But thank you everybody on YouTube for smashing the, the like and all the stuff you Appreciate do. Appreciate everybody. Let's um let's begin with a cruise through the internet, 1995. Oh. I don't know what to expect here. Tell them F5. F5 in the chat. <laughs> cool. Already Whoa. love it, though. Yo, I love that this dude's the internet. I love that his tie goes all the way up to his chin. <laughs> Whoa, Telenet. <laughs> yep, it's getting scary. Buckle up, Chili Poodle. Spooky juices flowing for the cursedness. Prepare your Are we, did I just get hacked? Are we getting hacked through a video on YouTube? Through Netscape? Oh, that's what the internet looks like under the hood. Oh, it's like the carrot highway. Ugh. I like this music, though. This, like music's this music's good, better. too. This music's pretty good, too. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Goodness gracious, Godbreakers blowing it up, dude. I don't even know what to say. Let's go, man. He says, I'm back, baby. After a week of not watching, it's good to be back on the live experience. Djibouti Fod Epic. Woo! Loving the new merch. Just keep it up, Pops. You're a gentleman and a scholar. Louie, you're in a lane. You're a lane thriving and keeping it real. Love yeah. it. Yeah. yeah, I always stay in my lane because I'm good at driving. No matter what those fucking driving instructors said, dude. Stay in your internet lane, Lou. <laughs> dude, Godbreaker with the two hundo, man. Dude, thank you so much, man. Thank you so fucking much, dude. Glad to have you back. Wow, welcome back. On the internet highway. We're going to the Louvre in Paris. I'm currently researching the Gettysburg Address. There's so much information on here. It is incredible. <laughs> it is incredible. Yeah, the Gettysburg what, Address is pretty cool. I found a lot of information on rock. I like the giant filing cabinet. Some kind of wrestler up here. We got the guitar. Yeah, I think it's Owen Hart. Now check this out. Well, on the internet, I track the financial markets, mutual funds, treasury bills, and dividends, and all the ups Whoa. and downs on the New York Stock Exchange. Big business. Finally, I got great seats to the ball game. I could check out the view of the stadium from my seat right on my computer. Just an hour ago. <laughs> oh, shit. This is crazy. Just an hour ago, I was wrist deep. I was deep in that chest I cavity. was about to crack open this uh, toddler skull and perform brain surgery when I forgot, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I was deep in the anal cavity. So I went to Yahoo Answers, and I found a way to get rid of that cerebellum. It's that so pesky. Saw some stuff in there I'd never seen. I had to Google it using the internet. Did you know you need a prefrontal cortex? I didn't. Won't find that in your Encyclopedia Britannica. Interesting. I found out about a breakthrough in heart disease. It's oh, I just love lubing up his hand. It, snapping it. Who just has a skull on their desk when they're a heart surgeon? Yeah. This guy here. I don't know. You get pregnant doing butt stuff, so I had to look it up on Google. I learned a new way to knock up my wife. First child. You wouldn't believe all the information we found. Fucking internet lied to me. Said butt <laughs> stuff can't get pregnant. Here we are. Fucking liar ass internet. Yahoo that was answers. Tripping, Jerry. Fucking Yahoo answers. Found on childbirth. I'm looking up how to deliver a child at home. I'm looking to save a few bucks, so I'm looking at being my own <laughs> midwife. Six months. Now that we merge with a company out west, we communicate electronically. Nice. Ah! Ah! Is that is that Peter Griffin? That looks like um Zuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's that's Zuck and Zuck. Peter Griffin this is the metaverse. This is the Zuckerberg meta. Yo, this freaks me out. Hi, what if everybody. they finally upgraded him to the point where he looks human-like, but this is his original form? I have oh. uploaded my consciousness to the cloud, and I fully have transcended. Watch my final evolution. <laughs> I hope this form pleases you. Amazing, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> Zuckerberg. Can Amazing! Be. Now Zuck can... It'll be like the Matrix where anybody plugged into that thing... Like, you can just get, like, the agents and Matrix will just turn into Zuck. Yeah, imagine a world where you can get, download your, your brain, right, mm -hmm. and then 3D print your body, mm. right? Mm -hmm. And then you're just traveling through that uh, internet highway at, at light speed. That internet carrot highway. Yeah, they're taking a field trip. Large ears. He's to Paris, I mean, uh, buying great sized hey, let's, ears. Let's leave this man's ears so out. Let's of be it. nice to him. Tickets for ball game. This 1995 might still be around. Conducting yeah. scientific research and a million still other growing. things. Where? How? They're cruising the internet. Ah, the internet whoa. is a vast collection of computer networks 
linked together through a backbone which lets them share information. That old class. Is he wearing a onesie? Like it's just like a yeah, internet yeah. jumpsuit? He's dressed like he's waiting for a Haley Bob's comet to fly by. <laughs> he's in the movie Dune. <laughs> Reminds me of the first computer network built in 1957. And the engineers managed to send about 15 boy, words up, in a dude? second. Thank you, man. Today on the internet, thousands of words are sent every second of every hour of every day of the year. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, Can internet... we beat that record in chat right now? Is it possible? Can we do more than 50 words per minute? Reaches The internet wouldn't be able to handle. It would just get all impacted and backed it's up. Bottleneck. Into uh, the galleries of Paris, NASA laboratories, remote weather stations in Rio de Janeiro, Tracks Gunk the number Brazil. of sodas in a Our weather balloons are the best. Coke machine, which I'm sure is important to someone, provides device for the best barbecue dude? recipe. Looks and like is a great blood place brains. to look for you. See that? Ew, that's barbecue. <laughs> and is a. I don't know about that sweet baby Ray's. Zuckerberg that loves it. Gross. It looks like just ground beef mashed into a jar. <laughs> like the 3D, the modeler had no idea what barbecue sauce looked like. It's just raw meat. <laughs> you the face and is a great Real place to look for your next job. So why don't you join me for nice. a little cruise through some internet history? Is that kid from Knight Rider? Internet history. The Defense Department was looking for a way to secure their computer networks during a war. If one system was bombed, they wanted to be able to connect to another. And if that one was bombed, to yet another. This network was called <laughs> Arpa <Arthur's laughs> background. And thus the it's internet how fast was born. He's going. The idea was immensely successful, and by the early 1970s, non-military organizations wow. were given Five internet frames access. Per second. Non-military internet. Scientists, educators, I like and the internet students quickly took advantage only. of the network no and more the information damn that could be shared. Scientists. In 1979, the first online service was offered by CompuServe. CompuServe. Today, CompuServe remains one of the leading online services. <laughs> Where are they at now? <laughs> Where are they be? Where are they at now? Who that? Its success Wait, is the result CompuServe? of effective use of internet technology. In 1983, the internet had grown so large Where that standards were needed so that all machines on the network, from personal computers to huge supercomputers, could zip through this. This guy's just going on. A, I mean, he's zipping through it too. For those, um, I want to see. Wow, wow, I want to wow. see some graphs. Eventually, Online, the internet, how we kind of know it, was kind of like made by Netscape. Like they would allow you to use HTML code to make mm -hmm. pictures and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then Bill Gates came in and stole it and got sued. For one, use the one you already Thief. have. That's why Internet Explorer internet sucks ass. Right. Fuck Internet Explorer. There it is. Oh, that's the internet. Finally. I was waiting so. for some real visuals. I want to see what the internet looks like. You know what the internet looks like? It looks like a tapeworm. It looks like a series of tubes. Spaghetti monster. And services are nodes on that backbone. Online oh, service. Oh, we're live on the backbone. So this is Twitch. Yeah, Twitch is in there. There's oh. one, one of these cogs here is like purple. Gotcha. You know. Which one's your when Twitch Prime? subscribe to an online service such as America Online, we have information at our fingertips concerning current events, weather, America travel, online. shopping, job banks, and internet access. Ooh. If you're on the internet, you cannot get into an online store. Wait, why does he have, uh, why does he have uh, sweetener and salt and pepper and an ashtray if he's doing big business? Strange diet. Listen, he's having a nice rum and coke with his business <laughs> meeting. You back the fuck off. I mean, it's peppering up his rum and coke. But back to the connection. First, find an internet provider. Look for one that will give you access to a local telephone number. That All right, chat, you taking notes on how to get an internet provider? How to find a provider. How do you find a provider? Yeah. You know what he kind of looks like? He kind of looks like the deep from the boys. It's me, the deep. A little bit. To me, he looks like Red Rat Dude, but... The yeah. shallow. Or you buy. If you plan to use the internet a lot, let's say more than 10 hours a month. You 10 hours a month? Yo, I do That's a 10 lot. hours just g going through Pornhub. Bro. Oh, my God. 10 hours a month. You understand what, what, what we're doing over here? Now, and not only that, but I'm multitasking multiple tabs at the same time. Imagine 10 hours a month. Dude, I couldn't even do a, a subathon. How much you'd have to value those minutes surfing. And can you use unlimited amount of data within those 10 hours? Or No, it's slow. <laughs> Was it like 250 kilobytes? Oh, you actually? boys were living in the future at that point. There are national providers that access through an 800 line. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Is, is, is that Skull one of his patients? Magazine. Ah, failed him. <laughs> uh, newsstand. I don't know if I want my store. surgeon to have a human find skull on his desk. Do you think he picks it up and has like Hamlet soliloquies and stuff <laughs> in the moonlight? I hope so. 
A dial-up account is exactly what it sounds like. The dial-up's so slow. Your computer dials a phone number to connect you to the provider. You log on with a name and a password, and you're connected. Now, depending on your needs and your budget, you can choose... Quit giving me them prank phone calls on my internet. I don't like people playing games. We found a provider. Ask them about computer and modem. That big buff poster. I can't... Right. Who's that sexy buff guy? Is that Dwayne the Rock the Johnson? Dwayne the Cock Johnson back there. Because the data transfer is faster. Look kind of like Shawn Michaels, actually. It's the same line as your telephone. ...to learning tools, but not all He's a real the HBK kid. the same tools for using mm -hmm. the software. And you figured out the type of access you need, whether it's shell or slip or PPP. PPP. Graphics, sound, and video. They're getting the, video. the weeds on the internet. Graphics. Oh, it's Tyson. Oh, it's Tyson. Oh, wow. What is a website? <laughs> what is a website? What is it? What is it? Man, old internet was just way better back in the day, dude. Everything had a nice big drop shadow, nice a lot of round stuff. Yeah, everything looked like um, wow. a an art project I did in <laughs> seventh grade. Dude, I wish I could go back in time and just make websites in this time. A world. Oh, he'd be Dude, rich. I would know how Blank to make the coolest the website. That you're yeah. Visiting. So, for example, we could go to the home page of the White House. The home page of the Yo! White House. I'd like to file an email complaint to the Link White to the House. The do not go to whitehouse.com. Do not go to whitehouse.com. That is a porno that site. You will get banned. Well. You will get banned. These search engines are usually... Whoa, Whoa they talk about worms? This is weird, design. man. Have been used over the years. Let's talk about email. E-mail. <laughs> sending and receiving email is very similar to sending postal mail. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's just post. like it. Wait, just like the post. The the news that you read is the collective email contribution. Where's that real cursed stuff? Themselves. When you subscribe, avoid get saying, rich quick. Complete senses yeah. and proofread. Proofread for mistakes. No one wants to struggle through a message full of typos and spelling errors. Yeah, Chad. Next time you make your next message, make sure you proofread it and use proper grammar. Come on, Chad. Degenerate. Please remember. What don't up, lazy use the internet. For get rich, oh, also, uh, uh, pause it right here. Uh, Twitch Prime is a free sub you get with Amazon Prime. And if you have Amazon Prime, you get a free Twitch Prime sub. So make sure you use your Twitch Prime sub every single month. I highly recommend it using on our stream. Thank you so much. Pain letters. Because if you do, your administrator may cancel your email account. Email account. Wouldn't it be fun to use a million dollar computer for a couple of hours? Uh, what would you do with a million, a million dollar computer? A million dollar computer. What would you do? Red Dead, full graphics. Red Dead, four K. Max out Red Dead and eight K, everything <laughs> ultra. Computer. And watch it actually run it. Yeah, that'd you be know what cool. I would do. I would do that. I would mine Bitcoin, bro. Whoa, Bit mining for huh? an hour, <laughs> mining Bitcoin for an hour. But dude. on a million dollar computer, do you know how much Bitcoin you get? I wow. actually don't know. I don't know. Me either, but I'm sure it's a lot. <laughs> While cruising the internet, you would have access to thousands of computers with Telnet. Telnet is an access tool that allows access you to log tool. into a remote computer as if your computer Whoa, was attached to Whoa, the cloud? To it. He's talking about logging into the cloud. He's talking about remote connections, dude. Whoa. You understand what that is? That was a game changer, man. Freaky. Ooh. Look at the file before Archie. Getting in on the F Archie, for example, and the search begins. Notice that you're given all the information necessary to FTP any of the files on the list. <laughs> Do you know what FTP stands for, Justin? File. I don't know. Yes. Yeah. Oh, file. Yeah. Tell it. No. no. <laughs> Transfer, Transfer protocol. Transfer. Oh my God. PC Tech. What's going on, dude? Good to see you, fellas. Remember when I first saw the internet back in '93? It was rough. Yeah, it looked like this. Program again. Then ask your friends. Oh, he's stuck. It's loading. Can't even. Keep driving. How they're using the internet. Oh, that's a big sub. That's a big one. That's a big one. Axel the Bard. I got peer pressured into getting rich quick. Hey, thank you for your Twitch Prime, man. It happens sometimes. Don't kill your ISP. <laughs> peer pressure got me. Thank you for the Prime sub. Let's keep it random. Um, so apparently if you went to Star Trek Adventure at Universal Studios in 1991, they set you up with a fake cast and crew and you had to act it out. Oh, so you could be your own Captain Kirk in the uh, Millennium Falcon or wherever the fuck they fly? Exactly. Okay, cool. 
We've noticed a shocking amount of typos Hello, in your messages. And welcome I'm sorry, to but we're going to have to terminate your MSN Trek account. Adventure, courtesy of Paramount <laughs> Thank Pictures. Thank you, Dracula's SG. I'm Gene Roddenberry, and some of you may know me as the creator of Star Trek. The episode oh, you're about... The creator. He's the George Lucas of... Um... Uh, Starfleet you Enterprise. Never look, he's got ombre hair. He started the fad. You never hear about this guy. You hear a lot about Lucas. Yeah. You never I've heard about, about this guy a lot. What's I his forgot name? his name Doomberry? already, but I, then, when somebody you says go. it... Then what are you talking about? When you don't somebody know his name. says it, I know it. Yeah, but how many people do you know in public? You'd be like, who made Star Wars? Well, versus... how many people do you know who actually likes Star Trek? True. Yeah. Mm. Actually like I, it I'm curious what the like real it. numbers are. There's more Trek... There's got to be more Star Wars. There's some, now yeah, it's there Disney and everything. But back in the day, 91? Yeah, so like we're on like the just before the re-releases of all the Star Wars and movie theaters. So mm. maybe Star Wars is kind of dying. And then like the, the big word around town is like, oh, you could be in your own TV show with Roddenberry like telling you what to do. Roddenberry. To see is a first. It's the first time guest stars have ever played the roles of the captain of the Enterprise and the Vulcan science officer. We'll now give you a peek at the rehearsal session that went on between our guest stars and their two directors, William Chatner and Leonard Nimoy. See Whoa! The, see the microphone wow. up here? Yeah, I like that. Maybe it's a, the third moon of Vendor or something like that. <laughs> yeah, Universal, pick that thing up a little bit, huh? Emotion is the key. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> so they're green screened in. Leonard Nimoy couldn't make it. Spock. Shatner Wait, and Lemoy. Wait, they're green busy. screened into the green screen scene? Yes. I think this is a picture. You, 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 you must. Oh, no, they're, they're moving. The audience but no, Shatner is completely green screened. Oh, he couldn't make it. He's yeah. busy. Yeah. That you he has no shadow. Look at it. Captain Ocean. <laughs> the trick is to remove all traces of emotion from your performance. A Vulcan's what a actions voice. are dictated by pure logic. And remember. Right? <laughs> <laughs> they're like, he's in the room. The captain is the most important role in the story. The captain? The Vulcan? Are they going to fight? The Vulcan? Are they going to fucking throw down? You want to fight me, Spock? I've kicked your ass before. Come on, Leonard. It's the captain that makes things happen. It's his story. Bill, get serious. The audience watches the Vulcan. Stop. This bickering is pointless. <laughs> so when you sign <laughs> up, you get to sit there with your mom and your dad, and you're in the thing. That is pretty sick. Dude, your mom's your Spock? It's illogical. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> Reaction shot. Not bad. I'd say they're ready. What about you, Leonard? Indeed. I think it's time to, to boldly go. go. Oh, wow! wow. Look at that. That's some good place. Yo, Leonard Nemo's gonna fuck your mom. To boldly go where your mom's never gone before. Holy fuck. I'm gonna give her that Vulcan neck pinch. Oh, man. <laughs> gone oh, before. oh, oh. Awesome. That's better than real Star Trek. H seven zero seven point two. Doctor McCoy reporting. The crew of the Enterprise is busy readying itself for an ordeal Yo, that I'm sure will up, prove dude. to they be were trying. Finding a lot of this stuff. Yeah, Starfleet thank you, training mission. Below us on Earth, oh. Captain Kirk and Mr. Spock are Look attending at the future a conference Gold of Gate Federation. Bridge. Look at that. That's this sick. is the future, dude. Yeah, that's what the Disneyland ones look like. It's gonna like. look like Disneyland about fucking time. Yeah. Orders, which makes them unable to help supervise the new graduates. But at least I'm not alone. <gasps> George Takai! Ahura, Chekhov, Sulu, and Scotty are aboard too. Scotty you couldn't do. ask for better instructors oh, than wow. that. Ah, Dr. McCoy. The graduates are requesting permission to beam aboard. <laughs> there they are. They're waiting outside. <laughs> I want to see them walk in. They're just <laughs> waiting. <laughs> We're ready down here, Captain. Beam us up, Scotty. A flip phone! <gasps> they get to get beamed up. That's Ooh. so lit. <laughs> He looked at the camera. Medical log supplemental. Now we'll see how these graduates respond to real training. Scotty. Hey, guys. Welcome aboard. Oh, hi. Welcome aboard the Enterprise. Graduates, you are expected on the bridge. So I wonder what that was like to just stand there and just, okay, we'll tell you when to nod. Yeah. Got it. Next. So this must have cost like a pretty penny. Yeah. Cause like you're just doing now like green screen acting and, and then like they the give bridge, you this I, at the I end of it? I feel my nervous stomach acting up. I have to keep reminding myself that this is only a this training shit. mission. Oh, he's got space diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> dude, the gravitational pull of space diarrhea is intense. Yo, dude. they're in there. 
What does this button do? <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh oh. Did you see that? What does this button do? <laughs> it went by like a frame. Let's go frame by frame here. I think the desk disappeared for one frame. Let's see. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I've been beamed. <laughs> I see it now. What does this button do? What does this thing do? I don't understand. Charge to cut. What the heck? I've been teleported, boy. Oh, I'm in another <laughs> Qui Gon dimension. Oh. Please don't touch that. <laughs> Let's test the ship's phases. Yo, let's Not just now. test the lasers. That would be very dangerous. Jesus. I am Captain Doug. I am pleased to serve as your commander. Damn, this is cool, man, doing this with your mom and dad. Dude. I want to be in Star Trek. Dude, this is like a big uh, only child energy, mm -hmm. right? I am Science Officer Betty, reporting for duty. Yeah, what do they do if there's like five people that want to do this? I know, it's such a big cast. They all have to <laughs> juggle their lines. Mr. Sulu, ahead, warp factor one. Whoa. Hi, uh, Captain. The ultimate experience. Dude, where are they going to go? I wish they did this for Star Wars, huh? Imagine. Oh, dude. If you could be a little kid going, Chewie, turn left up here. Yo, I just had a flashback memory. Do you remember in the Star Wars store back a long time ago, you could take a picture of your face and they would put it in like a Star Wars picture? No, you don't remember I that. No, where was? Are you talking about Disney? Yeah, Disneyland. About? Disneyland. Like they would, you would like stand there and you take a picture and then they would superimpose your face on like a bunch of that. stuff. I remember our friend got his face superimposed on like Princess Leia, <laughs> and we were all standing there, and it was Ooh. the funniest no, fucking thing ever. <laughs> How expensive was this? Yeah, it's a surprise. Oh shit! Kirk is on that ship. Here come those dudes. I can feel it. Those foreheads. Enterprise time. Dude, why does he have a gaping anus? It looks like a vagina. Are these actors as well? No, uh, I think those are like um, actors in this. She's raising shields. Better luck you face this, sir. Raise shields, quickly! Fire! So stoked. Love it. Quickly! Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Just shake around. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good, uh, cl uh, uh, good Klingon pog face here. Where is he? Good Klingon pog. Oh, let the let the thumbnail update to let the you know people browsing their following section what's really the best entertainment on Twitch. Let's be real, right? Klingon YouTube video. Oh. Scotty, damage report. They knew right where they hit us, Captain. He's too happy to just be attacked by Klingons, you know what I mean? I mean, he's like, Scotty, <laughs> damage report. It's like, dude, you just got fucking attacked by Klingon. Show some emotion, kid. <laughs> yeah, you pussy. Wait, you're not Kirk. Wait a minute, who are you? Oh, fucking shit. <laughs> Drake and Josh looking ass. <laughs> no, but I am the captain. You? Captain? Ha 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 Try my face. <laughs> He's doing the emote. Where's Kirk? She didn't say anything. Kirk is on planet Gamma Alpha 4 in this star system. Damn, almost didn't get it. No, he's on Gamma Alpha 4. Hang out with all those ladies. Don't forget the line. Gamma radiation 4. Double gamma 4, bro. <laughs> you will beam yourself and one other crew member aboard my ship. Then you'll accompany my warriors down to that planet's surface. Awesome. And be if I don't find Kirk, I'll blow your ship across the galaxy. <laughs> what in places are you two doing? <laughs> Mr. Chekhov, you have the calm. We're being over. Beaming me over. Dude, he can't oh. wait to join the Klingons, bro. They couldn't do another take for him on that? You can beam, beam me, beam me. Beam me. Fuck. Beam me, baby. I just ruined the $500 <laughs> experience. Beam me, baby, up. Beam me up, baby. Dude, I'm, I'm on the edge of my seat. I can't wait to see what happens. This is dad punch a Klingon. Kirk is at Federation headquarters. <laughs> oh, yeah, I like the way they're looking at us. <laughs> Enterprise. So... Kirk is in fact at Federation headquarters. Oh, they're gonna 
Look at him. He's looking at his lines. <laughs> when do I hit him? First, I'm going to kill this would-be captain with my bare <laughs> hand. <laughs> Act and cool. I'm going to destroy Kirk and... The guy's like, wait, not yet. Uh-huh. Federation Wait. And... Not while Go. I'm holding this photon detonator. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, what? One minute and counting. 59. 50 we'll all blow in one minute. Paul, give me your coordinates, and I'll beam you uh. to the Enterprise. No. What? No. <laughs> no. Priority message no. from Federation headquarters, Doctor. It's Captain Kirk. Put him through. Jim. Bones, the conference is over. Oh, no one was here for this at all. Beaming them. Cool. Beep, 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 beep. I wonder what you do after this. It's a gag gift from a friend. You get to eat like Star Trek food? Oh, it was all a gag. It was a toy I got. <laughs> so you diverted a cling on takeover with a toy? The antics of Star Trek. Than I could have possibly imagined. Star Trek Adventure. Federation has reached an agreement with the Klingons, which hopefully in time will mature into a peace treaty. Oh, did you see the dog check out Allura? Hopefully it'll lead to a. Uh, Treaty of some Whoa. kind. Whoa. Pog. Oh, I did see another one that looked pretty cool. I want to check this out for you. Oh. Gun safety. This could get pretty crazy here. I don't know how good this audio is going to be either. It's the Star Rambo 3? These bargain bin Americans VHS love tapes. firearms. They own more guns per capita than any other nation in the world. And there is a historical justification Chills. for this phenomenon. Hell yeah, America brother. won its freedom by force of arms. By force of arms, its citizen army has defended that freedom for over 200 True. years. Our history is replete with heroes who, pistol in hand, settled our nation, <laughs> defended our constitution, and enforced the law. Wyatt Earp, Pat Garrett, Sergeant York. Film actors like John Wayne and Gary Cooper became stars portraying such men. And Let's the, um, see the intro. This guy's going to have the most <laughs> epic intro. Gone. But in their image, just such a man has arisen to walk Shaw. in their footsteps. Whoa. Winner of the Fucking unzips. <gasps> unloads. Look Damn. at the caliber of that bad boy. Big guns. 1985 Bianchi Cup. Winner of the 1985 World Speed Shooting Championship. Holy fuck. Fuck. Yeah, Four-time winner and reigning IPSC national Hands champion. Hands up. Hands up. Two-time winner and reigning two -time. IPSC world champion. 360 no scope. Rob Latham. With fog. Boom, Rob boom. Lethal Latham. Big, 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 big. Yeah. Big, big, Only big, big. once in a lifetime is a shooter with such extraordinary skills, Fuck speed, yeah. and accuracy Good timing born there, out of the face of the earth. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's a bunch of bull. That's a whole bunch of bullshit. Hey, hi, hey there, partner. Hey, now let's talk about safety first. Mm. Part about me. Anyone, even you, can do the same thing. All it takes is the right instruction, correct equipment, and a lot of practice. Bang, bang, bang. I'm going to share with you some techniques that He's have helped me over the him? years. I hope so. Some may work, some may not but they should make you a better and safer shooter. Sassy bo bassy. Shooting down those big penises. The action shooting sport has grown rapidly over the past 10 or 12 this guy's years. Awesome. And Terry this porn. Oh hell yeah. <laughs> I've seen this one. <laughs> yeah, there's some bad boys. Yeah, that's JCVD over there. Yeah. Looks like him. I'll show you how it's done. That was an El Presidente. 12 shots. El Presidente, in your face. What are you going to do about that? May seem damn near impossible, but it isn't. The techniques required are extremely simple, and we're going to teach them to you step by step. If that was a little quick, we're going to slow it down. Just grab you by the hip, square those off. So you're supposed to be uh, gun in hand, fully loaded, while watching this VHS tape? Yeah. Yes. Shooting stuff in your garage. <laughs> First, 
One more at normal speed. Yeah, to get a VHS tape out there. Yeah, right? Tough. Bang, 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 boom. See the laser coming off of that thing, dude? dude. That's a tracer round, brother. Now, Holy let's slow it down. Stuff. Now, now, let me pop my ult real quick on him one time. 50%. Move the, the hammer. Pay, move the payload. Psych. It's high noon. Pang, pang. Slow down to half speed. Pang, 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 still pang, seems pang, confusing. Pang. Wow, dude. Still confusing. Let's go to the basics. To become a good shot, you'll master many techniques. None. I'd point that right at the cameraman. Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> Rolling. Alec Baldwin style. One. The motion to the gun we will call movement one this is the least important movement of all movement a one. fast guy to a slow guy makes hardly any difference in time are you fast guy or a slow guy chat you fucking decide fire forts are life death situation so you bust Reload out some together. moves ping ping Oh shit, thing almost went off in my pants. The <laughs> world on fire, but you'll never lose a match with those. Ping! Boom! We've painted the target up now. We're gonna go to a slightly different version of that drill. We're gonna now shoot two shots. I thought I was gonna shoot some. Oh, let's see the dramatization. Oh, this is pretty badass. Well, I love that they got a fog smoke. machine out there. Today, yeah. With the power and steel and a spotlight in his hand. for the fog machine. Yeah. Nice. Ice in his yeah. veins. Let me see the application of these tricks. Hit the fog, boys! Roll the camera. Bow, bow. Yeah, he does know how to make an instructional video. This is badass. So let's say you're out on hot night on the town. Whoa. You're in the video game Streets of Rage. There's fog everywhere. Bad guys show up. What are you going to do? When the president's escort, escort shows up to the nightclub. Billy Harrington, I need your help. I need to go to the streets of downtown San Diego. Escort mission. I must rescue the president's daughter. Mr. President, Mr. President. <laughs> Mr. President, tell us what, what you're doing here. Mr. President, Mr. President. Mr. President, what are you doing? I'm just waiting for this guy to come out and start blasting. Everyone back up, back up! Back up, it's a goddamn president over here. Hello, everybody. Hello. Please, yeah. please, save your questions for the rest of America walking through. Please, save your questions for the conference, please. We just got out of Air Force limousine. <laughs> Excuse me, please. <laughs> Mr. President, <laughs> who are you dating? Where's the pop-off? I not questions. No uh -oh. questions at this moment. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm scared. Everybody down. Who's this guy? Oh, quick, get in the, get in the Air Mr. Force president. limousine. He's got a fucking Uzi. He's gonna save the president. One guy with a good gun. Kapow. Got him. President saved. You're Let's welcome, Mr. President. Let's roll that back. <laughs> Let's find out when that went down. This tape is about basic. It was that hit movement. Hit competition Ooh. shooting. What you just saw with yeah, so you know what? These guys are imagining that last scenario as they're shooting those targets. Oh, yeah. Just oh, yeah. Fuck yeah, Mr. President. That, yeah, the president shaking your hand. <laughs> yeah. Go on, God. And uh, in an unprecedented <laughs> moment, you just a medal of honor for saving my it was life. not instruction on self-defense shooting. Fuck yeah, shooting. fuck yeah. Ping, ping, shooting cans in the backyard. Ping. In competition, we call those no-shoot targets. How we do those in the competition. Fresh off the hip. In many stages in Ipsic shooting. Ooh, I like his little pelvic tilt. It's from holding his gun in a certain way. I That's like what that. keeps his uh, balance, you know. Yeah, so he wraps arms nice in the pelvic tilt. Yeah, lead forward with your hip. In many stages. <laughs> <laughs> Even his clip, his magazine was sassy. Numerous penalties. The guy like cocks it. Oh, he cocks it from the top. <laughs> yeah. He oh, like reach around the full grip on it. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> you usually do it from the top. He came from the bottom, and gripped the whole thing. That's how uh, Steven Seagal cocks his guns in the movies. He does it from like the top. He goes mm. psh, instead of like doing it from the back, right? You yeah, know, like which is more. I think it's badass to do it like that's that. That's badass. That's badass. Yeah, that's badass. Steven Seagal does it like that. I don't like this little technique here. Contrary to what you might think, definitely not cool, but more effective when it comes to more efficient. It'll save you from numerous penalties. Do it again. In many stages. <laughs> 
<laughs> and he does it with just like his fingers. I like that. Like a three finger technique. Yeah. He's an Ipsic shooting. You're required to shoot one handed, be it right handed or left handed. Whoa. The scenario may be that you've been wounded. Damn, they think of How everything. How much of a gunfight were you doing? They think of everything. Let's say I just jammed my hand in a door <laughs> and then someone came out to murder the president. Uh, I got in a bit of a Krav Maga situation where I got stabbed <laughs> in my arms from judo flipping all these terrorists, and I only have one arm, one good arm. I got to be able to whip it out quick with my right or my left. Got to be prepared in any moment. When you're shooting one-handed, basically you want to quarter away from the target at about a 45-degree angle with your feet. Damn. It's got you want so your arm to be straight to better control the recoil. Your face should be straight on to the target straight so that you're on. looking out the center. Now we're going to shoot with our support hand and square to the target. The basics Yo. of marksmanship. Damn, that's badass. As mentioned earlier, techniques beep, beep, beep. used in IMSA competition many times. Damn, brave camera guy. <laughs> I'm very right? professional, but he gets shot. Don't worry, I'm a fucking pro. Shoot those, right above my head. <laughs> used in other disciplines. He's got like a tell. fucking ballistic shield in front of him. <laughs> the beep, arms and beep. the shoulders. Should remain in pretty much oh, the same position. Oh, do combat rolls too? To oh place yeah. The gun. Start about three or four feet. I had to do combat straight. rolls. Oh, As your left bah! hand touches the ground <laughs> and the so legs are straight, do a burpee feet real quick. Rearward. Put your weak hand straight down below you. Love this guy practices with like just both, both arms. Like he's got that much straight. time. He's just like oh, I'm gonna practice my left arm today. Ooh, yeah. These drop shot. Gotta be prepared. Good luck shooting me when I'm all the way flat. Slowing the fall as much as possible with your left hand. Oof. As Dude, your Max gun hand hits style. the ground. Dude, he didn't even drop the gun at all in that fall. He, he, he always had it on the target. He's taken that fall a million you. times. Do you think he Push can do it while he's flying through the air? The firing grip. I think he Disengage fucking practiced. Oh, Align yeah. the sides. And he definitely only bring like a little shopping cart out there and do those like jump on it rolls. Oh, yeah. Stranglehold Dude. style? Yeah, yeah. stranglehold <laughs> style. <laughs> Dolphin dive, yeah. Fuck yeah. Yo, Doswell, what up, dude? 90 months. 90 months, sub. Keep going through the bargain bin here of VHS tapes. See what I got for you. Doswell, thank you so much, man. You have more how the internet. There's a lot of how the internet. I don't know if we want to watch this. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is, uh, this is uh, some uh, footage that I recorded uh, when I was hanging out with uh, both of Chat's moms. Yo, what the fuck? Just the title of this. I don't know. Are we sure we can watch this? Oh, yeah. So there's this two ladies somewhere in probably the 80s, 90s talking about... Yeah. About cum guzzling? About something. You know, I never say Mr. Right. I, I think of it as Mr. Right now. That guy with the bongos happy to be in there. He's like, I know a thing or two about this. He's like, hey, anybody wants to try? Now. Oh. I can conjure up a cup. Oh. Man, I want to <laughs> fucking mage. We can do some shooters later. I can conjure it up. The guy yeah. away so quickly. Right. But I've met lots of Mr. Wrongs. Auto my fire. first lover was incredible. He made me do all the Kama Sutra. All the Kama Sutra? So he gives you the book. He's like, all right, I need you to read up on this because tomorrow we're going to be working out a lot. How many pages is the Kama Sutra? It's like a thousand. When you're done reading that, I need you to do an oral report. Physicians, cool. this is my first. All of them? Yeah. My first time out. This is definitely cursed. Now we are in the cursed territory. Is this from like real sex on HBO? What the fuck is this? And then on top of that, I had to swallow his sperm. Yes. Had to. Ew. I know. On the first day? Yeah. On the first day? So full comma, yeah. full comma sutra first date. That's a thousand pages. And an oyster shot. Well, you know, it's just incredible. I mean, it's really spoiled the experience for me. Yeah, I could see how that could give you a complex. <laughs> it's, not what, it's not the type of support you're expecting from your friend. <laughs> Meanwhile, Bongo guy's over there just waiting for his cue. If they say my name, I swear to God. Just waiting <laughs> to start bongoing. Bambalaya! Bambalaya! I wish I could overcome it. Well, you know, I have Overcome it. it too. Get it? I mean... All those sex goddesses are always like swallowing every last drop, licking it up. Yeah. Yeah. She's like, no, whoa. No. It looks so good. What? <laughs> what? What the fuck? Is Bongo going guy on? is like vibrating over there. Trying so hard not to bongo. Trying so hard not to change the subject with bongos. Well, I even made up a. He's all those 
sex goddesses drinking it up like it's this holy nectar of youth. Who are these sex Found goddesses <laughs> lapping it up? This is, where did you find it? I don't know. Hey, we have a really interesting Discord. Shout out to the Discord. <laughs> song about it, you know, it was bothering me so much. Really? Bothering yeah. you? Kind of a familiar tune. When you have a problem, you write songs. Yeah. Wallowing sperm is something I would like to learn to do before I die. Some people like it. Why, oh, why can't I? It's kickball really, change. I know kickball what you mean. change, and here we go. It's not that I don't love you, dear. Oh. It's just that when the time draws near. Ugh, I'm sweating. This is so. Ugh. This I, is the most cursed video I think I've ever seen. Yeah, this yeah. is going to haunt your dreams. Yeah. yeah. Feel a little gross? Yeah, I feel dirty. I still don't hear any bongos. Yeah, where's the bongos? <laughs> it's Andrew like Ford. Oh. Her throat gets all fear. choked up with fear. fear. Yeah, really, I get so nervous. It's all about yeah, the coup. It's kind of like a gagging reflex. You know, you just can't control it. Yeah. To tap dance about this subject. Wow. It, that's, you know what I, I would never think this is a real thing. Tap dancers are real f cum guzzling freaks. <laughs> hey, right? don't shame people for cum guzzling. That's what I learned. Oh, there it is. Don't shame people for tap dancing. Oh, no. You can shame them for that. That's fine. Jesus Christ. Yeah. What is this, the 1940s? I hear it's Who's tap dancing anymore? Oh, casually talking about it? Yeah, just casually talking about slinging rope. The taste grows on your top, a top, a top. You like oysters? Anyone Pops did say oysters earlier. Anyone want an oyster shooter? It's a little chaser, yeah. you know. Except I've already developed my taste for oysters. Oh, he's over there? He's using the little tassels on it. <laughs> oh, he's in the little... Like make sperm flavored ice cream or hey Milton you, oh my God. <laughs> you want to come over and hang out heat that up in the microwave <laughs> oh my God why is this how is this real <laughs> what is happening dude you know what's funny is like, this is so cursed this is in a weird corner of YouTube man. someone in chat like uh, is thirty seven thousand views someone in chat is watching is like mom <laughs> oh. Ugh. <laughs> wow. Sushi flavored sperm. What? Wait, wait, why? Don't bring sushi into this, man. Don't ruin sushi for me. I got too much on my mind I'm never going to be able to have a volcano roll again. Oh, those. Oh. A Philadelphia roll. Oh. <laughs> 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 I'm that's, already a little grossed out by those. That's why I don't get the Philadelphia roll. I don't know what they're doing in that one. That's, yeah, it's, it's the cum shot of sushi rolls for right. sure. Right, or... Chicken with hot spicy sperm sauce. Yeah. I just had Nashville hot chicken yesterday. Do you have to ruin it for me? Oh, great. Tortilla soup's ruined. Do you dip your uh, ranch all over it? It wasn't ranch. It gave us like... Now I don't even want to think about what it was. Yeah. It was cum. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That Sperms. Is, um, that's vile. So I want to shout out to the Discord. Uh, thank you for finding these videos for us. Uh, I don't was know where you found those. Was that in your mom's VHS collection? That was a palate cleanser. Now uh, we can all... Something we can all laugh about. Well, I'll never do tap dance ever again. I'll tell you that. Silent. Silent laughter. Our next exercise is silent laughter. You can open your mouth wide and just laugh without sound. This is yoga? See, that's great, but you know what's more fun? Laughing without moving your mouth. <laughs> that's another yoga. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. They're all in a room doing it. The mic is just turned off, dude. Come on. I know. Is, it would be great with room, like, room noise. My 24-7 VOD of silent laughter with chat. He literally took clips from earlier in the video and just took out the audio and was like, yeah, that's good enough. Silent laughter. I mean, chat silently laughs, you know, if you think about it, right? Yeah. I don't hear the 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 echoing drums of a laughter. When I read LOL, I hear it in my head. Um, Whoa. 
a dating video. Yo, 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 who wants a date in chat? Chat, we got any lucky singles? Anybody want a hot date? Who wants a date? Hi, Holy I'm smack, Marla Look at this and party. I'm going to be your love guide tonight on Make a Date. We've brought the best part about this is it's totally silent for the sake of the audio, so everybody's just doing silent, silent laughter. laughing. Single men and women from all over the country, right here to Boomerangs in Las Vegas for a wild Boomer party. Boomer headquarters. So hang on. Yo, this guy with the backward wow. paper boy with the... Choop. Got that the chin line. Sc chin strap, dude. All right, let's see some lucky singles. And hot, hunky guys to introduce oh. you. All right, chat, where the hot hunkies at? Hey, this party's... Dude, I found one! <laughs> Damn, he looks like the Night up. Stalker. Really rocking, but earlier in the day it was positively smoking. It was. You'll see what smoking. I mean a little later in the show. Some of our gorgeous single women challenge each other to a volleyball. I mean, uh, uh, to be fair, like this was probably recorded like 20, maybe 30 years ago. Yeah. Still a hunk, right? He's got the wazo going. He's got just pure sexuality. <laughs> Tommy wazo, like Tarzan wazo. <laughs> a wild man with a wild mane. Once I'm out of this uh, big poofy pirate shirt. I am a wild man. <laughs> really? Oh, hi, doggy. Looks like the shirt that Jerry uh, didn't want to wear. That, that lady <laughs> made for him. shirt. Yeah. Yes, how I did. Hi, I'm Pamela, and I like to party. If you like to party. <laughs> and I like to party. <laughs> hi, Pamela. Hi, my Check name's Pamela. I like to smoke Marlboro Reds. I like to fucking party. You want to party with me? Call now. Me out in the hot bod contest. 69 cents a minute. Whoa. Smart. Watch out. Don't tell me. Watch out. Test later and I'll show you why I'm the girl to call. Hi, my name is Brian. I play baseball. I like jet skiing, water skiing. If you're the girl for me, I'll run the extra mile for you. Give me Damn. Give me call. Damn. Yo, he's smooth. Give me the call. mustache with the reverse Kango? <clears throat> Fuck. Hi, my name is Tasha. I like to party and I like to dance. And if you're the man for me, call me. Call me. Oh, I want to speak to Tasha right now. She seems like a real ch hot party chick. She really Hi. projects. Call me. I'm Sunny. Tongue and I like ring. smart, funny men. A tongue ring. If you think you have what it takes. I like takes. the way she hold that microphone. Yeah, they definitely use the long microphone for a reason in this commercial. Yeah. Didn't have to. You know, you don't really need a shotgun mic for that kind of an up-close situation. Do people still get tongue rings? Yes. Like, mm -hmm. I, I feel like it's not as popular these days. Not as popular. I feel like it was right. really popular in the 90s, and I think, like... Where the tongue rings at? Anybody in chat? It still happens, but not as, like, popular. Anybody in chat got it? Just give me a call. Thank you. Wow. Wow. Yeah. So crazy. All these singles. <laughs> <laughs> Only 69 a minute. <laughs> a lot of fun, and to be... Hey. My name is Samantha. Basically, I like... Oh, dude, Brian was just up here. Now he's... Back on the dance floor. Someone called him. You, just, they, you need to call him quick. They called gotta, him, dude. You gotta call now. While supplies last. We don't have this many Bryans left. Men that are a lot of fun. And to be entirely honest, my criteria is that you need to call me if you want to find out if you're my type and if I'm yours. She's desperate. Rap got at that. Pick up the phone. Her requirements is just you can <laughs> pick up the phone. Dude, phone. the way she stares in the camera, pick up the phone. Pick up the phone. <laughs> uh, be careful calling that. Hi. Whoa. Whoa! This Whoa. guy fucks. Holy shit! Oh, this guy I'm might kidding. have herpes. And I need a girl that doesn't just like me because I'm in the band. I also like. Oh, you gonna guess he's in a band? Uh, he, he, he dropped that in there. I'm in a band, so you know. Oh, oh PC Tech. Yes. PC Tech. He's like, give me that number. I need to call Kenny. Thank you, dude. Computers Thank you, going to work every day and being a family. This is man. a very She's like fucking humping. <laughs> bad. I mean, I don't blame her. Uh, but I mean, that is an extra <laughs> stage mullet. Yeah, that like, is. that's a mullet on the next level of mullet. Makes me think of uh, that guy, uh, the guitarist, uh, Queen. Brian, yeah, Brian yeah, May. Brian May. Brian May What's crazy is he not only has party in the back, but he also has party in the front. Mm -hmm. It's double party mullet. It's a lot of partying <laughs> on the sides, even. Keyboard player for sure. Big keyboard energy off of this guy. Love the monitors in the back. Yeah, just off. Makes it futuristic. Hey. She got the tongue out over here. See, the, the they're like, oh, damn, I don't You're know. You're my type, and if I'm yours. I don't know if I Pick should call her, and then you watch it. The next thing, wait a minute, Brian's got some fucking rhythm. Whoa. Hi, I'm Kenny, and I need a girl that doesn't just like me because I'm in the band. I also like computers, going to work computers. every day, and being a family man. Wait, a family man? Whoa. whoa, whoa. So why are you calling him for? I like being a family man. <laughs> How would you know? Wait. Hi. Is call he, and find out. Does he have a wife? My name is Asia. I'm pretty wild and crazy. If you think you can... She's like... 
taking a pit stop from all the dancing too, huh? She's winded. She's like, I'm wild and crazy. Handle me. Make sure to check me out at the Slush, hot dog contest. Look at that gamer posture, too. Yeah. Posture check. Hi, my name's Kamisha, and I like a man who can exercise his mind, body, and heart when he's training with me. Can you the do lip all bite, that? though, dude. Can you do all that, chat? <laughs> Whoa, that shoulder went up high, boys. <laughs> when he's training with me. <laughs> <laughs> So, ladies, tell me what's wrong with the dating scene today? <laughs> well, sometimes guys are afraid to approach me, like I'm going to turn them down without giving them a chance. Right? True, turn dude. Him down. It does gonna... kind of sound like she has COVID. I wouldn't yeah, want to approach her. You're going to turn them down without giving them a chance. <laughs> right. It's like they assume you're booked to the year 2000, but there I am at home painting my nails. <laughs> <laughs> 69 cents a minute. <laughs> you see, guys, when you make that call to the number on your screen, you will be hooked up with beautiful. Man, <laughs> <back. laughs> confused. confused. This guy, I don't know what the hell this is for, uh, but I'm down. They <laughs> Looking straight women. into the camera the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't want his girl at home to see this <laughs> <laughs> commercial. But yeah, bro, call the number. We're talking no rejection. It's so easy. It's totally <laughs> super private sus. and confidential. You can talk about anything you would like. So why be shy? Pick up the phone and make the call. Pick Just up that do phone. Do it already. Dude, the I DJ. don't know. Dude. I don't want to be here with this guy. He's scaring me, man. See, the thing is, DJs, they get it, man. They just, uh, they put out the vibe and they get the vibe back. Oh, this guy over here is getting it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Got off work. Hell yeah. Thanks, I'm oh, dude, I got to see what this guy has to say. <laughs> this camera guy, chill. Oh, uh, my name is Mike. I'm an athletic person. I like to run and get outdoors, see new things. I'm looking for a girl that's the same way. You know, I'm a <laughs> was he showing his skills? <laughs> was that his cunnilingus call? Yo, ch chat, <laughs> study that, all right? Football player. Um, I like girls that are uh, athletic and like to do what they like to do. Like to do what they do. Man. I like when people do what they want. Hey, do what you do. You know what? I'm not just gonna be over here going. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what? You just do you. Hi, I'm Sasha, and I'll be in the hot bod contest you'll soon be seeing. Hot bod contest? Hot Yo, how does bod. one become a judge in the hot bod contest? If you like what you see... Wait, is it a hot... Never mind. I think you got what I need. Please, call me. Hi, I'm Tracy, and I'm looking for a guy who's spontaneous and likes to have a lot of fun. Look at this guy in the giant shirt <laughs> over here, too. It's in the bowling week. It's me, Gary um, Fieri. <laughs> I like to play the guitar. So I like somebody who enjoys music. Got yeah, the sound here. Yeah, the, it's, it's a little kind of obnoxious like here. Like time. Hi, my name is Paulina. Yo, Brian's back. I'm very competitive. Keep your eyes up, Paul. I just love a challenge. That's why I entered the hot the body. <laughs> Nobody wants to dance like the Paul. So it's <laughs> it's like a, uh, yeah, uh, orchestrating gonna, a concert. His dance moves. <laughs> I'm very competitive and I just love a challenge. <laughs> that's why I entered the Hot Bodies contest today. So if you're a man that's athletic yeah. and energetic and you think you can keep up with me, give me a call. Yeah. Wow. What a party. Wow. And the this women, party. Hot, hot, so hot. crazy. I'm super sexy rising. smoking. Can you even believe it? Holy wow. macaroni. Okay, then they do the Hot Body Bikini, contest. beach, volleyball. I just want to, uh, also, we're very pro women on this stream. Love women. Yeah. Real Respect to all women. Good time. Come Look, on if in. I could be, I would be looking for a good time. Hi, my oh. name's Mike. I'm athletic. I like music. Uh, I'd like to meet a woman who uses her mind and enjoys the same interests as me. Use your mind. Dude, it's a young guy, Fieri. I like to use my gut, brother, if you know what I mean. I'm looking for Flavor Town. Which way? Can you point me in the right <laughs> direction? <laughs> I like to take a plate of nachos and go. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, dude! Whoa. It works! Watch so, out, Mike. So here he is, hogging up the line, but he's already eaten. Big Mike! Looks like Flavor Town already struck, brother. I didn't even need him to be on there for a minute. Look, he wasn't there for one minute. This chick is probably getting 20 bucks and a free huh? lunch, and she's like oh, getting horned up. I'm this like, one again? Same yeah, girl. Yeah, some girls get, uh, they get twice. 
Oh, it gets extra cursed as it, it goes dark. on. I don't know what's going on what's here. What's happening in that part? <laughs> I don't know, dude. A lot of dancing. Uh-oh. A lot of singles. Wait, who's this? Was that E-Rob? I do call on all it's the time. It's Drake. Joey Coco Diaz. Oh, the color. Oh, my God. I do call on all the time. I have great conversations with the girls. I have a good time. <laughs> Wait, you can call this guy? I call all the time. Yeah, it's really hey, fun. It's me, Pete. It's really fun calling in. Pete. I call on all the time. You guys, you know, you really got to call. You won't believe your ears. Believe me. Take it from me. You won't believe your ears. You won't believe your ears when you call. What? You won't believe your wallet either. Jesus. Are they going to tell me, like, secrets about the government and stuff? 69 Maybe. cents, bro. And if the word contortionist means anything, give me a call. It does. You give know what it means? Call. It means they can stretch a lot. Contortionist. contortionist. Yeah. It's like a gymnast, but different. I've always wanted to have a conversation with a contortionist. With a mangled, bro. folded over body. A lady folded like a chair. <laughs> Awesome. And then it's just more swimsuit stuff. <laughs> All right, well, there's that one. Let's see what else we got. And I know we've talked about this on the past on other ones, but uh, you, when you call these, you're you're talking to a person who's very similar to Louie. Louie's done that, that bit. Yes. Yeah. Well, I did text, so it was hard to get away with. Yeah. So, I don't think I could keep up the girl voice, you know? That would be too hard. <laughs> hey, boys. What's going hey, on? Hey, boys. <laughs> I'm very curious what this next one is. This, this is, is the video I was talking about earlier. <clears throat> this is the last acting role for Michael Jackson. Oh. In a, a, a no-budget independent film, Miss Castaway and the Island Girls. Here's the scene where Michael, or the character, encounters Michael Jackson through a hologram. So this is it's from an also actual known movie. As, also known as Silly Movie 2. Silly Movie? That's what, it's, that's what it said. It was Lee D. Thank you, dude. Is that Ludwig? Uh, Ian coming in, too. Real boring. And, uh, yo, Fliz Axe. Thank you for the brand yo, new crime. New sub. Kills party. Do I want a robot? That. Where's the remote? What Listen, the... my son. The Pope? Yes, His you. Holiness. This has become much more serious. Agent Ran took on an impossible mission and failed. It is now up to me, the you Pope. to save us. Breaking what it down. F heck are you talking about, sir? In the loft I have there. assigned Agent MJ to inform you further. Oh, he works Agent with uh, the God. And swipe. <laughs> the Ark will sell for 40 days and 40 nights. Yo, he got so dressed up for this. This must have been some crazy favor, huh? So they probably woke him up from his propofol fall uh, binge, oh. and then they're like, "Hey, MJ, I know you're you're tied for cash. Can you do this quick read for this guy in his movie?" You must stop it. I an Agent M. <laughs> I wonder like how old this guy is. Was he like a kid friend of Michael? Uh oh. And now it's like time to get a favor back. I'm in a movie. I really needed to testify on my behalf. Is he still stuck in that like age? Because like he's wearing like children's pajamas. That's what I'm saying. Maybe but then there's like, that lady. Yeah, she's a fake ma is a mannequin. Why? It's our only way off the island. You have to stop it, Mike. Is that actually MJ? I think so. I don't to. think you could fake that. They, they, there's some you close, can't fake There's this. some pretty close ones, but that's definitely it. That's definitely 100%. You can tell by the nose. The arcs it's in the nose. You can tell. It would trigger the most terrible, horrific storm, the perfect storm, if you will. History shall repeat itself I mean, uh, I, 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 I love Michael Jackson as much as the next guy, right? Amazing talent. He's got a good voice for acting, but he just looks like Michael Jackson. Yeah. It's I mean, undeniable. I mean, yeah. Like, he's probably, the out of the three people that we saw on screen, he's definitely the best actor of the three. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He's been in a lot of stuff. Unless you, Mike, can prevent the, uh, with the whiz? Unless you, Mike. The only way to stop this catastrophic event is to destroy the Ark. Destroy the Ark. Destroy, it's weird. It, it's almost like Michael was in, like, a Neil Breen Yes. Cameo. Yeah, exactly. Yes. It's just like, oh, yeah, I'm good friends with him. One time I saved his life from oncoming traffic, and he said, okay, you get one. <laughs> get one time. He gave me a card with a number to call. I give you one for you one afternoon shoot. You can redeem <laughs> this for anything, but you only get one. Instead of getting his own song, he got him to do this. I mean, yeah, I know. Yeah, I'm gonna, exactly. I was like, yo, Mike, I got a song. I want you to do a little... <laughs> 
verse in there. Uh, do you have like a speaking role I can participate in instead? No, you're like, I'm in a fucking, <laughs> I'm in a little no budget independent movie. I want you to do yeah. a little, you don't even have to come in. We'll send a green screen and you, and you destroy the storm. Noah is being held against his will. Held. And the ark has been taken over by species. <laughs> being held against his That plans on surviving on the ark and taking over mankind. I like to think that when they were filming this, Michael, Jack uh, Michael Jackson literally thought he was talking to, you know. This is a video message. <laughs> like an actual. <laughs> talking to the future man that's going to save humanity. The storm ends. What species? The world is dependent. The jacket, too, man. Yeah, he brought that his own. God. It's so sparkly. He had to get that out of the collection. Like, normally he's walking around those silk pajamas. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He had to go into the closet, pull that shit out. I like or silk. tell somebody to pull it out, you know? Easier to dance in silk. Oh! On you. I'm dependent oh! on you. I bought all your albums. <laughs> God bless you. Aww. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I know. What species? I know, I've seen it. <laughs> And then he's gone. Interesting, though. Didn't know about this. Wow. His last appearance. It really makes you think that we could make our own movie. It kind of makes me want to make a whole movie based around that little clip and just cut the Michael Jackson part out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, we got um, shop safety. Ooh, trigger warning. Does this one look good? <clears throat> this one's good. No blood, huh? There's no blood. Okay. Okay, because sometimes chat... Oh, oh, fair warning, especially those of you who have worked in these kinds of shops with very dangerous tools i will warn you this is like if you get anxiety very quickly you will get anxiety Ooh. oh no but yeah. it is good there's some pretty good uh you know we're oh. talking fingers buzz saws oh my god <laughs> okay it's, it's good. I'm just triple screening it because if some guy's finger, fake finger comes flying off, I don't want people to pass out in the chat. I don't think it shows no. any fake fingers flying. They just do the, the good uh, acting of like, oh! Okay. You know, that. Oh, boy. Be careful, chat. Chats, Ontario. Split second. Yo, Wonk, what up, dude? Old Boone. Hell yeah, brother. Oh! I think it doesn't have a guard on it either. <clears throat> oh my god, that looks so oh, bad already. Oh, fucking shit, his hacks all fucking, fucking going dull. up right in my face. <laughs> Ooh, drill press. <sighs> Get this wood around my arm so I can grab more wood. Oh, I can't see you behind this blade. How to be safe in the workplace. Bing bong bing. The oh, big game. Pass. Come on, Ralph, throw it in here. Come pack on, Ralph. it in, pack it in. You're gonna hit somebody's fucking car. Sorry, Mike. A little off to the right, I guess. Nothing unusual, Ralph. <laughs> Yo, hey, this Catch. guy. Throw away. Nice. What? Are they just going to eat those people's food? <laughs> I don't Ralph, know if they were there with them. ever going to learn how to throw? <laughs> what are you, clumsy on, or what? Boys being boys. Years, and he still can't throw. Well, look at the cock imprint on that guy. Larry. Jeez, fucking man. Jesus. <laughs> this Larry. fucking guy, dude. Slaps you on the back. You got a big, sharp knife in your hand. Yeah, you're God. trying to chisel very <clears throat> finely against your hand. Hey, buddy, did you know we were just playing pass the ball in the park? Oh, you missed out on a great ball pass. Woo! Awesome team. You can throw the ball a lot better than Ralph. Yeah, Larry, maybe you can teach Mike how to uh, catch the ball. Hey, Mike, heads up. Why are you doing that? Uh, no! Kunk knocks him out, head on the buzz soft, grinds up his brains, grind up his brains like me. Wait, women are gonna get chopped up in the women's room? From the rest of the class, considering that they're all men. Yeah, I know what you mean. But really, I like metal shop. I mean, I'll be able to use some of that stuff in my jewelry design. Cool. Well, I'll see you later. I think I'm late. Yeah, okay. Say hello to the guys. Yeah, okay. <laughs> the machinery. Either check with me or read the manual. It's the dangers of not wiping while wearing a white mini skirt. Shop on my bookshelf in the office. Big risk. I know all and about those risks. Don't forget to wear eye protection when you're on machinery. Mm -hmm. 
and remove loose clothing, like ties, <laughs> and roll up your sleeves. It's the only day he wears I think it. You should <laughs> remove day the jewelry, one. like watches and rings, too. Okay, any more questions? And, uh, that's a loose then concept get to it. of safety. Remember, you've got a written exam on Tuesday on shop safety. I mean, there's an accident every year, pretty much guaranteed. Oh, High yeah. school shop. We knew a kid lost a thumb. Whoa, really? Yeah. Really? It happens all the time. I swear it probably happens once a year. But they're like, we got to keep this program. It's good for the kids. I liked woodworking. Woodworking was fun. It's good for the, you know, 80% that are following the rules. Yeah. It's great tools for them. A blood sacrifice must be made. Don't get your hair oh, in there. God, it's so hard to watch. Watch your hair. Ah! She's laughing. Did you get the picture? <laughs> bang, bang, bang. Rips her scalp right ah! off her head. <sighs> hey, Dingus! Watch where your thumbs are going! Larry, Larry! Come on, Larry, it's after 5 o'clock. You oh. have to leave right now or we'll miss the opening kickoff. Hang on, I've only got a few more to do. Just give me a couple of minutes. We'll be right Hang on, the here. saw's okay, hot. Leaving in two Still minutes. chopping. Okay, okay. I'm addicted to the blade, man. I gotta keep going. My dad has a saw like that where if your finger touches it, the blade just goes inside the machine and breaks. I'm not gonna try that theory. Yeah, I'm not gonna try it, but I've seen videos. Uh. <laughs> it can tell the difference between a human finger and wood. Oh, yeah, just right through that little hole there. Monka W. What's going to happen, dude? Ah! It's thumb placement. Ah! Oh, my God. What are you fucking doing? Ow, 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 Ouch. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> kind of looked like not much happened, but still very look fucking that bad, small. Scary. Canada, they can't show all the blood. And stuff. God damn it. Losing top of your finger doesn't look that bad. <laughs> 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 that form. Slide it. That's the move. Yeah, work smarter, not harder. Oh, fucking what thing's gonna bash his head in? Oh, this guy's just That's flammable. That's tripsy. Wood. This guy's just dropping wood everywhere. Oh, oh gosh. You're People. bumbling around! Oh my god, it's a fucking straight up cartoon gag. Oh man, he's got the red barrel at his feet. You know that explodes. Just gonna step on this, it's gonna boing. Chill, god. chill, 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 chill. That was it. That was the end of Ted. So, uh, why don't we catch a bite to eat at the plaza and we'll film there later? Mm, I can't. Captain I'm going Charisma to over here. Finally, I'm uh, gonna yeah. bite the eater. Huh? I'll get some uh, cu uh, cold cuts. Show Maybe after all, mate, I might drive you home or something. Crafts can harm your health. What do you mean, like dropping a tube of paint on your foot? No, stupid. Like inhaling dangerous solvents or poisoning yourself by putting questionable materials in your mouth. Yeah, Judy, which Where one do you like better? She's sucking on a screwdriver. What? The fuck green was or? she thinking? <laughs> she's just sucking acetone. Blue. <laughs> You can joke all you want about it, Jim, but you can harm yourself anywhere, not just in factories, particularly when you're least expecting it. Kathy, an accident's not going to happen in a design studio, so why bother wasting your time going to an industrial Oh, no! no. Ah! <laughs> As he was talking about never getting injured! Ouch. <laughs> that would never happen in a design studio. Let her rip! Nothing bad ever happened over here. Oh my god. So, what can I get for you today? Our special today is quiche with a side salad. This is the final destination. Ah, uh, no thanks. I'll go with the burger and fries. Everything. Yeah, what could go wrong in a restaurant? Uh, you know when they have those hamburgers where they put the pin, like the, the, the oh, toothpick shut up, in pops. the middle of it to keep it structure? Please, oh, God, fuck. no. Well, you know what I always forget about? What if you slipped and your face went straight into the deep fryer? <laughs> Thing on the bread. That oh. always freaks me out. Whoa. Like, whenever Whoa. I see a fight video, Whoa. they're, like, behind Whoa. the counter at McDonald's, I'm like, dude, somebody's going to slip into the fryer. Whoa. Somebody's going to slip into the fryer. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, and then their, their, their head comes out. It's just a big chicken nugget, like, ah! perfectly. <laughs> you have no face anymore. You're just a chicken nugget. I'm deep fried. <laughs> 
Uh, no, no, hold the onions. Okay. And uh, give me a beer with that. Beer. Right, and a beer and onions? Is that what he ordered? What would you like to take? <laughs> I'll have lasagna with meal. salad. <laughs> lasagna salad! And a side order of garlic bread. <laughs> garlic that must be bread. a Canadian thing. I never heard of lasagna salad. Yo, before. I want lasagna salad so bad. Lasagna salad with a garlic that sounds bread. Fucking good. Lots of garlic. And uh extra give me a coffee. Okay. And a coffee? Don't you like that coffee stinky now? Stinky yeah. shitter over here. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Come on, Ed, loosen up. Have a beer. It's not payday every day. Are you kidding? I'm loose enough after a heavy meal. And Feel? sleepy. The last thing I need to do is drive a saw under the influence. Oh well, suit yourself. Do you Smart saw. Suit. Oh no. Driving under the saw. Suit yourself. I guess that's two beers for me. All right, more for me. Two pitchers coming up. <sighs> well, that's yeah. more like it. Raring to go, Ed. Well, I think I should have went with a quiche and salad after all. I'm stuffed. Boy, that lasagna salad's giving me the diarrhea. Something awful. Oh, I've got the diarrhea. Oof. Hangover blues. I don't think this ricotta cheese is agreeing with my lactose intolerance. Oh, boy. <laughs> Having a burger. Well, time might as well Kids just get weekend, back to it. Why don't you guys it. join us? Yeah, that sounds good, but I'm not sure what we're up to this weekend. Not sure what we're up to. I'll give you a call later on. <laughs> I'll be home at 8. Great. Right. God, the saw. I'm already so afraid for this guy. Oh, he's good. He didn't drink. I know, oh. but still. You know what's going to happen, though. I know, it's coming. And that blade's still ripping and roaring as he's... Skirt! Oh. Loosen up. Loosen up, will ya? <laughs> Loosen up. Just a beer, beer, chill, beer, chill, beer, chill. beer. Just faster, one. Faster, faster, beer, faster, beer, faster, beer, faster, beer, beer. He's sleepy from all that food. Oh, well. Suit yourself. Yourself. I feel like I'm gonna chop my own hand off at any moment. Yo, this is freaking me out. Cajun salad! Cajun salad! Cajun salad! I hate the way they're fading the footage together. This is horrible, man. Oh, God. Just a salad, 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 lasagna, salad, 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 salad. Just a lasagna, lasagna, lasagna. Couple beers. Salad, salad, salad. Did he fall asleep? He yeah, but he fell face first into it. <laughs> Cut him in half like Frieza. <laughs> oh. So how's the new computer working out? Oh, it's like trying to fly a 747. It's a lot slower than the one I used in school. I always seem to be waiting for it to do its thing. Are these kids in high school? I know what you mean. I don't know. I've got one like that at home. I guess I he's in the like out. woodworking section. She's like the architect like next door. Yeah. Creating the plans and this is the cafeteria. Thank you. Take care now. Bye-bye. It's gonna happen. It's like watching Final Destination. We're all looking for it. Like, <laughs> yeah, is it that guy? Is it? Ah! Oh, fuck. You know, wait for it to stop. Is a chunk of wood just gonna Are go you flying? finished? Yeah, just a sec. Good wood. It's all yours. Okay. All right, how's it going to go out? Bring out that saw. Extra high. Full velocity. Let her rip. Oh, my God, that pinky. I can't get one. I can't. Fuck. Ah, oh, my God. Like that. It's, it's so hard to watch. Ah. Chill, 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 chill. Ah. No. 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 Don't do it. What the fuck is he doing? Stop. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I think it's because he turned off the blade, and once it slows down, it gets a grip yeah, on the yeah. wood, and it flips it. I yeah, know. it's like the wood, like a wood man came in and was like, "How oh, dare you drop up my children?" A fucking tree came through the window. It was gonna beat him up. Oh no, it's gonna kill me! <laughs> I didn't oh. mean to. Oh. It's Let's kicking back. Salad. The wood's kicking back. Oh, that one was so hard to watch. The way he's splitting his fingers. Why on is he it? doing the V on it, dude? <laughs> it's like me to chop your hand. Uh -oh. Right in the webbings of his fingers. God. Oh. Power saws are fast and convenient. There are occasions when they're just not the right tool for the job. Time to go There's do a, a lot to be said for hand tools and good old fashioned muscle power. Are you kidding? <laughs> okay, the that's saw. our lesson for today. 
back to your projects. And remember, cleanup time is 15 minutes early, so don't waste time. Let's all say a prayer for Brenda who got scalped a week earlier. <laughs> Told y'all not to fuck around with that long, curly hair. She got that fresh perm and it got caught in them gears. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah, I'm gonna make a sweet ass fucking kick flip. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. All right, I gotta fucking put this C vice on it. This is gonna be a little hand tool job. <laughs> Yeah, dude, fuck that. No, oh, fuck this, dude. Let's get something a little faster, huh? Just some more horsepower. Let's kick it up. Hey, what are you doing? Are you using that bandsaw? No, I'm busy. Oh, the industrial grade bandsaw. Oh, no. Oh, no. No eye protection. No goggles. No, no goggles, no goggles, no goggles. God damn it. This is so All right, cool. Jesus, take the wheel. I trust in you. Oh, just hold that Close lid. my eyes. Don't let the splinters get in there. Yeah, it's like a Ouija board. Just let it go. Yeah, Do it just takes. Thing. Just got to feed the wood. Oh, look at that. Got to feed it. Oh, yeah. Getting a nice, good cut. Chill, chill, chill. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa Back whoa, it whoa, up. Whoa. Back it up, Terry. Oh, yeah. Oh. Uh. Hey man, did you watch the latest season of Sea of the Boys? What's up, dude? <laughs> Watch. Yeah. Why is everyone trying to surprise each other in here? And with probably the most deadly, the router's like incredibly God. dangerous. It's like the the most, the number one time in life where you come in real slow. You're like, hey, hey I'm, I'm here, I'm here. Can you just wait easy? for them to finish. Yeah, wait for them to finish. It can wait. Or just fucking wait. Yeah, even it can better. wait. Remember, hey, no you... surprises in woodshop class. Hey, did you hear that? God of War's gonna release in November. Oh, God. <laughs> it can wait. Oh. Things gonna go flying. Oh, Whoa. Whoa, man, that is scary, dude. God. It's just a power sander. It's not that no, great. it's a router. <laughs> that is. It's gonna it's go a router, flying, dude. dude. Tommy, try to tear check. How's the router working out? Still getting Still on. Let's go get a coffee. No, I'm putting the manual on it, and it said, uh... Got the coffee. Oh. Damn thing. What's going on with the sander? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Instead of unplugging it, he's like, oh, I'm going to catch it. Oh, what a fucking idiot. Hot sander. Gotta catch it! Catch it with your hand! Things flying! Dee -dee -bee -bee -dee 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 -dee. Dee's concerned of all the scaring of having her limbs chopped off. I know, Dee Dee. We got scared on that one. That one was good. I like that one a lot. Yeah. I also like the subtleties on it. doesn't have to show, you know, their heads getting chopped off. You know that was um, very scary. <laughs> Sorry um, for the anxiety, people. Yeah, we got... McDonald's training. Oh, safety training. You guys want some McDonald's training? Safe. Something safe. A place where we're not going to die. Whew. Well, I mean, you could die at McDonald's. Oh, God. You could deep dive into the deep fry. Like I said. Being safe. Managing customer satisfaction. And at uh, McDonald's. Shouts to the uh, the Discord. The Discord was where we found all this uh, videos. Straight, uh, straight hype. Thank you so much, man. Do you guys hear this video chat? Yeah, can you guys hear this? It's only coming out of our right ear, so I don't think you guys will hear Sometimes this. Sometimes it doesn't work that way. No. Nope, 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 oh. yeah. Damn, yeah, we can't watch that one then. Yeah, that one's coming out of the right ear, so it's, uh, we must have one of our cables backwards for mono. Let's see, uh, this one's how to handle the raw product. Whoa. Maybe this one you guys will be able to hear. Maybe that not. That one's right side, too. Yeah, this is right side only. All right ear. Damn. Damn. People are throwing down that one. Okay, what's this one? Maybe this one's both ears. Right. Right ear also. Oh, this one was the good one, too. Damn. For real? Check yeah, the settings. The Maybe there's one. a mono setting. Yeah. Yeah. A mono setting. Like, go to, you YouTube? see the little uh, cog wheel? There's no mono. I know, but I thought I'd. I had a workaround for it, but is this the good one? Because I can salvage it. 
This is the b best one okay. of the um, of the YouTube uh, McDonald's training. Let me salvage it. While you're doing quick. that, I'm gonna give a quick shout out to all the generous people out there. Japanese frog, thank you the four months. Love you so much, dude. Big time recruiter with the hundred biddies. Uh, Youch my finger. I know. Be careful out there. Um, Tanto corazón. Thank you for the 30 month prime. Mr. No, gifting out a sub. Thank you. Wonkmeister with the 10 month prime. Awesome job. Thank you so much. Old Boons in the chat. Thank you for the 44. Thank you. In the loft with the 500. Much love. Riri, thank you so much for the 20. Wizard Lee, uh, thank you so much for the big words. Let's see here. I'm gonna backtrack a little bit. I am Cruz with the 11 months in a row. Uh, Real Boring Dow, gifting out a sub. Uh, Bizlax, new sub in the chat. Thank you so much, brother. Thank you very much. Frisbee with the 21, Ataku Corpse, PC Tech, Holy Jumpin', uh, Encanto, Auto Fire. How you doing, man? It's been a minute. Doswell, uh, Ninja Turtles and Hunter Bees. Uh, Jesse Ventura from the original Predator praises the Prey movie. I've heard it's good. It's good stuff. Yeah. It's right ear also. All of these are right ear only. Yeah. It must have been the way they recorded it was uh, in mono or something. Give your That one you should have heard. That one we can do. Uh, I want a video about Tech Deck. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Shout out to Saskatoon. Sack Canada. Dijon. Oh, DMCA. Oh, it's so cool, though, dude. Whoa. Look how sick that is. One wheel. Ooh. Did you see he flipped it? Brought thing? it around. You had this VHS? Nice. Nice. Skirt. Skirt. Pop shove it. These guys are pro. Get sponsored, dude. Dom sponsored. Sponsored by the tech deck, dude. Skirt. 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 Fucking shredding so much goddamn gnar. The sweaty fingers, the little sticky fingers. Why didn't this take off as much as it did? It's a lot of fun. He's like uh, putting up a sweat. Look at him. If you're going to tech deck, though, I highly recommend getting an actual wooden tech deck instead of the shitty plastic ones. But these are the pros. They use wooden ones. Let's get you started, dude. I'd say... It's like Tony the, Romo. The easiest things to learn. Oh, we got the fucking soundtrack bumping, though. Say I do a quick little swoop, swish, ollie. Oh, laser flip. I'll do a little whoop, middle finger twist. Whoop. Shoo. Skip, scat. Poof. I saw that they have, like, official buildings where you can, like, do this. Mm. Like, they have actual, Whoa, like, full-blown miniature parts. I've seen it. I've seen a lot of YouTube videos on it. I got really into it for a little bit. Uh, it was one of my uh, deep dives into weird things. Oh, yeah? You and, were tech decking for a hot man? Yeah, I had, like, five or six, like, of the wooden ones. They, they're so lit, dude. I got pretty good. I could do, like, a... Not like as smooth as these guys do. These guys are really good. It's all like on Instagram, like, or, t you know, TikTok. T tech deck TikTok goes big, dude. Yeah, And really? they put little shoes on their fingers. Oh, cool. They like drip out their fingers. It's pretty fucking cool. Tech deck TikTok? Tech deck TikTok's pretty big, dude. Saw some kid, some like seven year old the other day did a 900 with him. Not, not tech deck, actual skating. Oh, and he was His like, was twisted. Tony Hawk there in the video? I don't think so. I, I saw one it. where this young kid did the nine over a 900 and uh, Tony Hawk was there to like shake his hand and stuff after he did it. It's like that trick that he worked so hard for. Now some like seven year old just like, wet me twice. It's pretty nuts. Got it. Push twice. I never could get that damn thing to Ollie yet, dude. You gotta get the, you gotta get sweaty fingertips so you can do it. It's all about momentum. You gotta like push it forward and pull it back at the same time. It's like weird. Push and pull. It's hard to describe. Uh, Butch Cole three with the tier two sub. Welcome back, man. Uh, just got engaged. Whoa. Oh. Cool. Dude. Love watching videos together. That's awesome, man. Big pog. Congrats, Cole. Big pog. Joey the Grand Congrats, Lotus with the 27 dude. months. Thank you so much. Gert Turtle, 43 months in a row. Much love. Dr. Chocula, tier two sub. Shout outs to VOD gang. Yo, Dr. Chocula, how you doing, man? Miss you, brother. Mr. Chuck. Uh, Encanto Big Papa with the 350. Uh, this was my first year catching Jabubo. Uh, Pops, you did an awesome job. Justin, the animation was sick. Nice shirt, Luke. Thank you. Thank you, dude. Thank you so much for all the kind words, dude. Jabubo was a lot of fun. 
Can't wait for uh, the winter brawl. Make sure you get your practice in. Uh, multiverse is taking over the world, man. I finished the battle pass for Multiverse. Yeah, I just beat it last night. Yeah. Got all the stuff until the next season. That game is a lot of fun. I was like, I'm not going to buy this battle pass until I finish it because I don't want to waste my money, you know? Yeah. Trying to a re -render, I'm trying to re-render this video in mono. It's been a long time since I had to do this. Do, 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 do. How's see. everyone doing? Let me see if I can slide this. Participate in my little experiment here. That sounds no problem, better. You know, no go back, you had a stereo. Participate in my little there we go. Participate in my little experiment here. You guys can hear that, right? My little experiment here. I feel to just do this, though. Let's see, yeah, can you guys see this yes. and hear this? It's a stormy night at McDonald's. Yes. Mm. Cool. Smart little fix, Just That's Scary. 69, dude. Nice. Thank you for... Okay. Folks, want to thank you for all working a slightly different schedule to participate in my little experiment here. Uh -oh. No problem, thank Coach. You. No problem. Hello. Whoa. Uh, I don't know hey. if your uh, night lead uh, should be fi uh, filming you in your McDonald's like what? this. I'm your manager. We're it's close. Experiment. We're friends. What? Let's get loose. Nobody knows you here. Get crazy. Loosen up, Louie. I like the way you're cleaning up that kitchen. Just let me film you a little mm. bit, man. I want to show the uh, upper executives just how hard of a worker you are. Also, also shake those chicken nuggies for me. Yeah, also, fucking... great job on those French fries earlier. <laughs> you really Hi. shook them out. Um, hey, Coach, what's with all this camera stuff? <laughs> Hi. Oh, oh, there I am. Hey, oh, I can't believe it. Hi. <laughs> hey, folks, I told you we were going to make history tonight. Did I not? Yeah. Yes. Uh, you... It feels like it's about to get scary. Or turn into, like, a multi-level marketing scam. <laughs> uh, you should all know each other by now, but in case you don't, this is Pete, and he works mostly evenings. Hello, Pete. So this Pete. is Claudia. She works mostly breakfasts. Pete uh -huh. and Claudia are a couple of stars on our service team. Uh -huh. This is this here is Danielle, and she's new. And this is Jeff, and he's new. A couple of Jeff's uh, working on an acting career. He's trying to work on that Luke Perry vibe. New. And this is Jeff, and he's <laughs> new. working on that... that, that perfect like blank face is it a smile it's a smirk i don't know he's mysterious i don't really know he's luke perry's stunt double in his next movie <laughs> and he's new a couple of future stars on our service team i think it's safe to say let's give him a big round of applause future stars on our service team Smacking you all know uh, our crew trainer and you're not with america's funniest home videos are you ha <laughs> ha <laughs> and is our video and party consultant today and you all know me i'm lou your trusty coach no Turn big lou coming no! in me, your boy Lou. Turned videographer. Oh, oh yeah. Good, good side. Good side. They're both good sides. Huh? Yeah, right. Okay. Now, you all know the basics about working the counter, Excuse right? Me. Delon, could you please turn the radio down back there? Sure, I had no problem. Oh, I thought that was. Um, I didn't realize that was real music playing. I thought that was a backtrack. Some guys actually back there rocking out. Yeah. Um, tonight, though, I want to work on going beyond the basics, beyond the standard, beyond even the customer's expectations. Unpopular. Okay, it's like what we've up, been dude? talking about lately. 100% total customer satisfaction. Right, right. Exactly. Okay. Got it? Okay. And yeah, we are going to do a winter tournament for sure. We mm -hmm. just need to pick it out, pick a day, and pick the games and do all that. Nice. 100% total customer satisfaction. Right, right. Exactly. Okay. Got it? Okay. Now, tonight's a rehearsal, and we've got a lot of things I want to rehearse. And could you hold up our list, please? That classic purple McDee's. I got that it from my in-laws. dark purple drip. Nice in-laws. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it doesn't hurt that we gave him a grandson to photograph. No, <laughs> Can you all see this okay on the monitor? Yeah. yeah. All right. Now, this is what I want to talk about. First, smiling and greeting the customer. Then we're going to move on to taking the order, which means using small talk, using names, and offering extras. Then I want to talk about assembling the order, presenting the order, and receiving payment. And we need to go over yeah, special... This filming it all, like, so up close. You're really videotaping this? Yes, I really am. Why? <laughs> this isn't for upper management. <laughs> this is actually just for me. Yes, why do you ask? Yeah, yeah. Samantha, why do you care, huh? Uh, relax. relax. And why? <laughs> Loosen up. And why? Because I look so stupid on video. Uh, I know you don't. <laughs> Pete, you're not nervous, are you? No, but that's because I'm not a real McDonald's crew person. I only play one on TV. Ah, oh, well, we'll have to get your autograph then. 
What's the first thing you put on after washing your hands? Hand on the hip while he films you? Yeah. Come on, people. On after Small washing talk me. Give it to me. After washing your hands. Uh, gloves. No. Uh, jewelry. Uh, no. Come on. A smile. Survey says bing. A smile. A smile, yeah. It's in the SOC, folks. Smile and greet SOC. the customer. Okay? Let's see it. Pete. Smile on command, Pops. Good, good. Claudia. Let's see it. All right. Let's see Danielle? it, chat. Great. Smile. Jeff. Force it. And hey, he's what? working on his, like, pucker, though. He's working on his, like, hey, I don't oh. smile. That's not my thing. I don't do that. I don't put out that vibe. I don't do that. I don't have a smile. Jeff. Not my thing. Jeff. Let's see your best smile, chat. Come Jeff. on. <laughs> you, guys, you guys are, like, halfway there. And what? Okay. Jeff, keep smiling, but look into the Jeff, monitor. Jeff, we uh, hired you at the Tell front register you because you're a hunky a uh, Jamie Presley. Like, where's that smile? Yeah, that's my you smile. Know, it that's seems kind of rude to be like, you need to smile. But, dude, there's this chick I worked with at Subway, and she was just always mad. Always like, mad? everything. Always mad. I remember on her last day before she quit, some guy's like, hey, can I get a, a spoon for my soup? And she literally picked it up and threw it at him like oh, this. shit. Oh, just oh. like... Whoa, Whoa, calm down, lady. How about a smile when you throw things at me? I don't mind that you throw it at me, but please smile. Who's the rudest smile. person I ever worked with? Bad answer. Bad answer. Here, take this. Point it at me. Okay? Now, see you see me? See you, and I feel Smiling me. Smiling is always a little goofy at first. It's like, it's what's goofy. this guy smiling about, right? But it's true what they say. Smiling is contagious. It, it's like yawning. You know how for some people, the mention of a yawn is enough smile, to get some people bro. yawning? I've never like yawned. Jeff's yawning. It's like yawning. See, look at Jeff. He could care less. <laughs> like Jeff's yawning right now. Give a fuck. <laughs> right here, yeah, you sure were. Smiling's the same way, though. When you smile, the whole world smiles with you. It's true. And you feel better, and the day goes faster. Plus, day it's part pain. of the McDonald's yeah. trademark. Makes the pain of working here go by faster. <laughs> Makes those grease burns not so burny. <laughs> so smile. First thing with each customer, okay? Okay. okay. Meeseeks want to know, what did the guy do back to her, Lou? He was like, can I talk to your manager? And then, like, the manager came out. He's like, look, I'm sorry. It's her last day. She's just a bitch. <laughs> under, under. He's like, oh, okay. Can I get a free cookie? He's like, yeah, sure. <laughs> I can't get it. I, I love this person. He's like, I'm getting a free cookie out of that. At He's least. like, yo, you threw a spoon at me? Free cookie. Free cookie. No. Okay, we're going to smile. Okay, let's move on to the next thing here. Greetings. Pete, smile and give me a greeting. Scary. Whoa. Excuse me? Greet me. Uh, how you doing? Great me, motherfucker. Okay, give me another one. Great me like you mean it, bitch. No, look, no, I'm a customer. You're Pete. Greet me. Hello. Welcome to McDonald's. May I take your order, please? Look, look, it's me. Listen, me, asshole. Lou, I'm here on my day off. Greet me. Hey, coach. Hey, Pete. Good to see you. Good to see you. RP? Hungry? Yeah, I am. You have, oh, to R you, you have to RP okay, happy all day long. Wait, are you getting paid while this video is being filmed, or is it just like you're, you're off right now and he's making you do this? No, it's extracurricular. This, it's is, this is just team building. Because if I'm getting paid to act on a video, I'm going all out. Like, mm -hmm. fuck it, dude. Mm -hmm. Fuck it. I'm smiling, dude. Good. Okay, good. I like that. Yeah, I like that. Good. I got it. Good. I want to walk down the line. I want each one of you to give me a greeting. It's me, your old friend, Lou. Okay? Greet me. Hi, how are you, Lou? Good, Claudia. How are you? Fine, thanks. Good, good. good. Hi, um, I don't know what to say. Oh, <laughs> okay. fuck. That's not going to work here at McDonald's. All right, that's what we call a big oopsie, and uh, you will be punished. We're going to have to let you go. I'm just going to go ahead and end it now. We're going to have to McDoc your pay. <laughs> <laughs> McDoc. <laughs> Goose the soundtrack. Uh, just search YouTube Twitch Safe Nintendo songs. You'll find a big playlist. You'll find a big playlist on YouTube. Hey Lou, what's up? Um, uh, what do you have? Still Something. not giving me any teeth. He did better than the girl before him. But where's the McDonald's teeth? But we he's smiling though. We the... got you to be the face of this McDonald's. Where's the ba da ba? Look, it's all it's Come on. it's it's like a little bit. It's just a say little... ba da ba 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 ba. You can't say ba da ba 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 without smiling. Say good. Uh, what do you have? Good, good. If you got, if you know my name, use it. That's excellent. Okay, Pete. Uh, this so time I'm a customer, with the but camera. you don't know who I am. Hello, my name is Pete. I'll be your counter person today. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sense of humor is not necessarily bad. But... We're not upscale. We don't want to lie to the customer. Listen, I don't want any jokes and funny businesses. McDonald's. <laughs> we don't want them to think you're pulling some prank on their burgers. Okay. 
I thought this camera is just always scary. Like, if you saw a guy out right now, you're out and about with your, your buds, you see a guy filming you with this. A camcorder? No. With this. That would scare the shit out it's of me. It's fucking terrifying. Nothing but if good is happening. If it's a phone, you're just like, what the fuck are they doing? You know, some guy's weird. just like this. Like, is he acting like he's on a call? Is it, what a weirdo. But that is, like, scary. Because that's like, I'm burning it to a physical, like, thing, and I'm going <laughs> to have it. It's yeah, like it's a, the ritual of holding it on my shoulder. It's a thing that I just get to have in my collection of, I filmed the park this day. It's almost like a, a an RPG of your soul. <laughs> Hello, my name is Pete Tao. I'll be your counter person today. Pete Tao? Uh, good afternoon. Wow, listen to that thunder. I'm telling you, it's going to get scary, man. Look, look at that rain. Looks like you just missed wow. getting really wet. Yeah. Wow, it is coming wow. down, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, really. Is. I guess we're gonna have to stay inside and keep filming. It's safe. You better not leave. We should hunker here for the night. See that? You're all talking. <laughs> We've got enough food to last us till tomorrow. Any hot pies? <laughs> We've got enough McGriddles in here. Drink Place this holiday pie on your, your chest for warmth. <laughs> Goose, what up, dude? The weather no always problem, works, man. folks. It's one of the keys to small talk. Yes, it is. That's weather. a good point. Which brings us to our next... People love chat. When you go to McDonald's, don't you love when they ask you about the weather? Yeah, I'd like a number one. Hey, how's the weather out there? Hot, huh? Yeah, it is. Can I get my I food? Yeah. Do hey, I don't want to talk about the weather? Yeah, put stuff in my mouth now. Topic, which is... I learned really quick, you never start small talk yourself. You wait for them to start it. Then um, you can go in. But only... if you're like sitting there like... Hey, how's it going out there? Yeah, he's like, can I just get my fucking sandwich, please? And yeah. You're like, oh, my bad. Yeah. Usually you get skipped. That the worst is they don't they don't do the just the open, just the greet. That's the worst. You go up to eat and they're just like, oh yeah, you always got to say hi, welcome to Subway, and then you go, hello, hey, hey there, and welcome like, to McDonald's. Like, how can I help you? It's like, damn, you don't even get to hello. Yeah. Small talk, Claudia. You don't know me. I wander up. <laughs> Good morning. Isn't it beautiful outside? Well, it's raining cats and dogs. Huh? No, you're a fucking liar. I liar! It was beautiful. <laughs> Shame on you, you for lying. You don't want to fucking lie to them. Boy, There's no really, lying at McDonald's. It's really coming down. It's 100 degrees. Out there. I know, but I just love the rain. Now, what can I get for you? <laughs> Claudia, you can take an old grouch and put a smile on his face. <laughs> Good save. I'll save you for now. Way to cover that up. We will remember this later. Enjoying the rain. <laughs> That's just what we want. Okay, Danielle, uh, you don't know me Please either. Stop. I come up, but you notice something unusual about me. What is it? You're filming me with a giant camera? Yes, yes, go on. What else? You have a, a mix save. You have a camera pointed at my face? Yeah, I oh, got it. No, hey, um, it's America. I'm allowed to film you. It's public property. Ignore, what are you going to do about ignore it? Ignore it. Ignore Actually, technically, camera. this is private property because we're inside <laughs> of a McDonald's. <laughs> Hi, Um, did you win the game? No, we lost. Oh, well, that's too bad. Yeah. So Yeah, what... I'm a big McLoser. What are you going to do about that? Are you going to make me feel better? So what could I get to... Uh, Soothe your wounds. <laughs> Soothe my wounds? Oh. <laughs> this is weird. That's oh. a little weird when the McDonald's girl is asking you to soothe your wounds. Can I soothe oh, Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to McDonald's, girl. Can I soothe your wounds today? Imagine you go to McDonald's, right? And you're like, she's like, how's your day going? Oh, not too good. I skinned my knee. She's like, can I get you something to soothe your wounds? Uh, like a That'd bandage? Be fucking weird. Or a hamburger. Bro. <laughs> well, I feel like there's going to be wounds in my food. <laughs> Let me get you a band aid in your Ooh. hamburger. Ooh. <laughs> Soothe my wounds. Soothe me? Whoa. Oh, yeah. Wounds? I'm wounded How all about over. Some bactine? Bactine? <laughs> all right. What's some what? Pain? It's How like Neosporin. How about some bactine? bactine? <laughs> all right. Great job, Danielle. Really. Okay. We don't fucking sell Neosporin here. You dumb We're bat. not a pharmacy. Really? Okay, okay, how about this one? Yeah. Pete, I'm tired. I have a garment bag over my shoulder. It's heavy. I'm dying to set it down, but of course I can't. Well, would you like to lay this on the counter while I take your order? Oh, thank you. Oh, thanks. That's much better. Sure, no problem. Would you like me to hang that up for you while you eat your lunch? Hey, you want uh, McDonald's lady to take your purse? I don't know if I want the coat service at McDonald's. Big Back bag. in the day, they used to do that. Like, they were trying to be like a restaurant... 
but not a restaurant. Right this way, sir. I'll Nowadays, you go in there, there's like a fucking, you can just press buttons and get your food. You don't have to talk to anybody. No. Yeah, I don't need uh, an employee McDonald's touching my clothes. Don't touch me. That'd be great. Thanks. I always hate that. Job. You go to like Carl's yeah, Jr. Good. and they bring your food to your table. It's like, oh, can, I just, yeah. can I just get my food myself, please? Yeah. Call my good, number. Good. Like, good. do good. I have to tip you now? Mm-hmm. Like, what, how does this work? Good. Yes. good job, everybody. Let's have a hand. Huh? Yeah. Excellent teamwork. Working together, so good. In fact, we're going to just move on to our next topic, which is using names. Oh. Danielle, I come in here all the time. You know my face, but you don't know my name. Okay? Greet me. Hi. Greet me. You come in here a lot, don't you? I'm Danielle. Hi, Dan. You come here You come here a lot. Oh, I, I feel bad if somebody that. said that to me. <laughs> I don't even want them to say that. <laughs> you I, come here a lot. You come here I a saw lot. you like three days ago. Come here a lot. Can we be on first name basis since you come in so much? Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like that. Uh-huh. I also don't like the wow, you eat fast. Oh, this is the Louis special, isn't it? I've heard that one a few times. Wow, you really ate that fast. It's like, really? yeah, I know. I'm Leave really me alone. Ate. It's a problem. <laughs> I'm Danielle. Hi, Danielle. I'm Lou. Hi, Lou. What can I get for you? Good, Danielle. Great. That's great. Okay, that was a Jeff, weird first person like, encounter for me. I didn't like that at all. That's yeah, RP Hi, for Lou. you. How you doing? Good. Uh, you know, I know your face, but I don't... Chick-fil-A, Chick-fil-A service is fucking nuts, dude. They take it to the next level. They're good, man. So- One time they made us wait just like a little bit longer, cause the, and it was no one's fault just because there was a lot of people. They're like, here's a free milkshake and a free fry Whoa. if you want it. And I was like, okay. My except pleasure. They're, except they're closed. And then they have to say it's a pleasurable experience. My pleasure. Oh, it's my so pleasurable. Pleasure. Oh, it's been my pleasure. So pleasurable. To do oh, that. so much pleasure. To give you that milkshake. Eat it. <laughs> Special pleasure milkshake. <laughs> oh, this gives you pleasure, too. They're NPCs. Yeah, they get in, I get NPC vibes from Yeah, Chick-fil-A. they got like a, a dialogue tree they had to hit. There's something going on you know what I'm deeper. Saying? A dialogue tree. <laughs> I, you know, I know your face, but I don't know your name. Oh, that's creepy. To hear that. I know your face. You know, I, I know, know your, your face, name. but what's that name of yours? I'd lie. Yeah, Ron. I'm Lou. John Ron. Ron. Ronald. 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 I'm Lou. I'm Jeff. Jeff, that's great. The direct wow, approach. Ronald I love McDonald. it. Ronald McDonald. Okay. The name is the magic word. Learn the name and win the customer. Right? Okay. Let's move on to the next topic, which is offering something extra. Like what? Sometimes a customer doesn't specify a size. We need to clarify mm. it for them. How do we do that? Oh, it's where you imply like, oh, you want the super size, huh? I'm going to take a guess. <laughs> super size? <laughs> they take a guess? Come on, guys. You that big Is one, that a huh? large fry? Would that be oh. a large Coke? But hey, uh, now. Now, what about shaming. the customer who's offended by suggestive sound? There we go. Good. My man, he knows what's up. Good question. Well, if a customer says that... Like, we don't fucking care, dude. You always suggest large. Because there's the chance that they just respond with, yeah, 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 yeah. That's more money. The key is, there is no small. There's never <laughs> been small. <laughs> the other day, we got, like, a medium drink just passing through, I think it was a Carl's Jr., Mm-hmm. Dude, it was fucking this big. <laughs> yeah, it was Carl Jr. has pretty big drinks, but they also charge you like $4 for them. That's yeah. how they get you. Like, That's a fucking medium? Can I have a child small, please? <laughs> Where, like, in order to fit in the cup holder of the car, it has to, like, go in, like, segments. It has to, like, go <laughs> up and up and up and up. It's the funnel through. <laughs> that's it. Then that's it. Don't do it. But what? if they don't specify a size, then you're really providing them with a service yeah. by clarifying the size for them. Oh. Exactly. Oh. One time you never suggested Let's self. be honest, most of those fatties out there they want that large, super size. Mm. And once they take a hit of that one single fry, they can't stop. Suggestive cell is with kids. Please, folks, never suggest a larger size or a dessert to a child. Jeff? I'll- why not? Actually, why? I, want I like sh- that. That's good. One. I want that big one. Jeff? Offering something extra should never be offensive. It's all in the way you do it. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, you're going to go for dessert? Uh-huh. <laughs> you deserve it, don't you? <laughs> Just make it a part of the conversation. Make it tempting. Right. Like with our pies? Have you tried our baked apple pie? It is mm. so good. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. I agree with that. Oh, with the ice cream. Though. Dude, yeah, you got to get the baked apple pie in a cup with the ice cream. Oh, dunked in How there? many people Ooh, have not done that? Sheesh. Oh, it is good. It's, 
It'll make you feel like shit. It's degenerate. Oh, yeah. It'll make it's you feel awful. It's McGen- degenerate. But Always feel awful. I feel like the apple pies have gone way downhill since, like, when we yeah. were younger, too. Yeah, it's like it's like a bunch of recycled newspaper. They're just sitting in the back on a heater. Like, yeah. on not even, like, a, like a sun lamp. Like, an actual furnace. Oh, <laughs> Hot cardboard with like honey on it. Like, mm. yeah. Absolutely, I agree with that. Just make it part of the conversation. Okay, I got one. Um, with a value meal, you can get a large fry and a medium coke for fifty cents less. Right. You want to go for that? Excellent yeah. suggestion. Yeah. Trade this, them up guy, to a better this guy's crunching numbers for you. I do appreciate the person that's like, uh, if you just get the meal, it's cheaper than just getting a fry and a thing, and you get a drink, but you don't need the drink if you don't want the drink. I want it. You know what I'm saying? Give it to me. Because if they have the meta that breaks the, the cash register, they should give it up front, right? Mm-hmm. Break. Is that what Very it is? Good. They don't fry them anymore. Oh, oh they're deep fried pies? That's oh why God. they were so good. Mm. That explains it. Break. Used to be a Very real pie. Job. Yes, excellent, excellent. I think we mastered offering something extra. Mm-hmm. I want to move on, though, to the main body of your counter procedures, assembling the order, presenting the order, and receiving payment. Uh Okay, I want to make a few points. First, assembling the order. Speed is important, but never at the expense of accuracy. Get in the habit of double-checking every order, okay? Second point is the order of assembly. Danielle, what do you get first? The drinks. Right? Cold drinks first, then the hot drinks. Uh Uh-huh. Then what? Then Then what? Then the salads. Yes. Then what? Then the sandwiches. Uh Uh-huh. And then the fries. Right, and the reason we do that is... So stupid idiot! You forgot the fucking money. Where's the pie? <laughs> Get the fucking money first. first. Lou, how pay much off. Get would the you? Bag. How much would it cost to dip your balls in a deep fryer? At this point, I don't really need them anymore. Mm. So you done, huh? I mean, a couple million, you know, just for the pain. Yeah, like three mil. Yeah. Okay. You buy like a house, and then you're broke, pretty much. No. Yeah. Yeah, I've already used them up. They're all ready to go. <laughs> Just take them out. I don't care. Ain't much left. <laughs> so, the cold items stay cold, uh-huh. and the hot food will be the hottest it can be. Right, great. Nice. Okay, Danielle, I'm a customer, and you know that there's going to be a short wait on my Big Mac grill you order. Still. Okay, assemble my order. <laughs> oh, well, shit. I can't assemble it until the sandwich is up. Yeah, what are you going to do? Tell the customer he'll have to wait a few minutes. No, no, no. Well, why does a customer have to do anything? Uh, oh, trick question. Claudia. I get the drink, check on the sandwich, and if the wait is less than, say, 10 to 20 seconds, I'd explain it to the customer while I shoot the breeze a few seconds and take his money, or... <laughs> shoot the breeze and take the money. Hey, good looking. Give me some of that cash while these burgers get flipped. Mm. Or... Maybe I'd get the fries Ooh. if he felt like munching right at the counter. No, now you'd get the fries before the sandwich. If that's Uh-oh. what the customer wanted, you're darn too. <laughs> you'd shoot the breeze. What about the other customers that might want to come in and place an order? Uh oh. Well, they- get this fuck head in the front eating fries. Talking it up. Just him. dipping it in a hot mustard. Hey, <laughs> I want my food. <laughs> oh yeah, the weather outside. <laughs> Mm. Well, they'd be my customers now. All right. That's what I like to hear. That's teamwork, folks. The point of all this is never let procedures get in the way of personal service. Oh. Right? We all know that if Pete hadn't been... The ab- rules are there, but they're meant to be broken. That's what makes us better than them. Once you're, once you're gaining a friend. Available, of course, Claudia would have had to sure. politely take the next order, move on, and the first customer would have to wait for their grill order. Yeah. Right? Most short waits, they're just that. Short waits, but an opportunity for you to get to know the customer a little bit better, too. An okay? opportunity to tenderize that meat that is the customer. An opportunity to film them from afar. <laughs> get your camera out and start filming. Okay. Giving you Starbucks, PTSD. Do you guys have to watch a movie for that? Is like every oh, place yeah. make you watch a video? It's just easier. Or is yeah. a lot of them just be watch Like for Subway, did you watch a video? Uh, like an, actually, no. Like it was a corporate... hands-on training, but we had to do like an online... Oh, you have to take, like, quiz things? Actually, I think there were videos in the online now that I think yeah. about oh. it, yeah. It's just easier to keep it consistent from a corporate perspective, yeah. right? You know, it was at Costco. We had to watch, like, a long movie, dude. 
Okay, yeah. let's talk about uh, presenting the order. Right, presenting the order. Oh yeah, that's right. Jeff, there was like a there was like a program you would go to before your first day, mm -hmm. where you would build the sandwich with a computer. Like you'd click like I need pepperoni, I need oh. ham, I need salami. That's a BMT. It was like a subway flash game. You yeah, exactly. Cool. That was exactly what. Get it was. the high score. I was good um, at it, so. I remember starting a new job, and, like, I, I convinced myself, I got to milk this training period as much as I can. So really go through these tests real slow and try to get two extra days of uh, paid uh, training. Just watching a video. Yeah. Uh, um, well, I'd tell them their total, uh -huh. uh, give them their food, yes, and maybe talk to them a little more. Right. What if it's a big order? Um, oh, no. Why some, think guy, about yeah, that? some guy comes and says, I want 300 nuggets. Badlands. What do you do? Yeah. Badlands comes and he's a big regular here. Badlands comes here. What are you going to do? What Dude, are you the weirdest do? training I had to do, we had to do a training for active shooters. At Subway? No, at Dave and Buster's. Throw a fucking sandwich at him? It, it was oh, like shit. so strange. Really? Yeah, I've never had to go through a weird training like that in my whole life. Oh, shit. What was the, is there anything It was like, if you one? can run, run. If you can hide, hide. If you can't do either of those things, attack. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, dude, that First was like the training. It was fucking weird. Louis jumping off a fucking um, arcade motorbike. Flappy Bird. I was like, dude, I'm going to fucking tackle his ass and stab him with the screwdriver. Like, oh, I'm like, yeah, oh, you thought about this. Oh, I had to think about it. I was like, I'm going to hide behind the arcade cabinets. And then when he comes by, I'll just pop out. Ah! Or hide in the big uh, Oh, the dude, big House of the machine. Dead, yeah. I'm getting that. The fucking Jurassic Park one, the Luigi's Mansion, where you like can close the curtain and oh, be yeah. in there. You got to get him. Fucking hide out. Oh, maybe I'd see if they need help getting back to their table. Okay, what if it's a big confusing order? Um... Well, I'm confused. Oh, I double check it. Yeah, right. Yeah, you could read back the order to make sure you double got everything. Double check it, triple right. check. Right. It. Would you do that before you took the money? Oh uh, well, yeah. Right, because we wouldn't want them to leave thinking that we forgot something. So much weird right? footage of this team. I, I need to know where this footage is going to go. My secret all for me. Yeah, like is he doing this for McDonald's corporate, or is he just going to like like Ronald's going to come in with a trench coat and go? Thank you. And just put it in his coat and walk away. <laughs> yes, Mr. McDonald. Yes. That'd be funny because it is raining outside. He comes in in a raincoat. Yeah. <laughs> right. Like Pennywise. Right. Because on big orders, sometimes the customers are the ones who forget to order something. <laughs> Very true. Slash Very true. Idiots. Yeah. All right. I want to move along now to the next topic, which is receiving payment. Oh. Two quick thoughts. First thought is, this is where accuracy is a lot more important than speed. Mm -hmm. People work hard for their money. Take the time. A lot of people come in here and they try to slip you up. Try to count the 20 twice. Hold the say, 20 twice. Can I get change for that? Confuse you. Take the time to come oh, back to the Hey, what's correctly. that over there? And they'll okay. do Second thought. Oof. Second thought has to do with kids. Let's say I'm a kid. My mother sent me up to the counter to order something. I give you the money, and I start to walk away. Uh, you forgot your change. Come on, Good. let me put it in the bag for you. There you go. Thank you, Claudia. Thanks. Money in the bag? What? Secure the bag. It's like I'm. He's committing robbery. Here, take the money. Uh, Weird. Put it in a bag. Put the money Why in the bag. Why not just hand it to him, weirdo? <laughs> Come on, right. let me put it in a bag for you. There you go. Thank you, Claudia. Thanks. Parents really appreciate oh. that consideration. Uh -huh. um, show kids the same courtesy, same respect you show all your customers. Of course. Okay? Right. Bunch of them. Great. Right. Money Let's kids running around. Special Stupid needs. rug rat. This section is about special orders, special information, special requests. Okay, not necessarily in that order, but uh, we're going to do a quick game of charades. I want my burger in the cup for the ice cream and then the ice cream on top. And then I want the french fries in my milkshake. Can you take the soft serve and put it in a burger? <laughs> I want to eat the soft serve like a burger. <laughs> just like a little, just like a little... You know, it's like a little layer of mayo, but I, I want, want it to be ice cream. I like it because my mom made it that way. The yeah. only special order I ever got at McDonald's <laughs> is I would get like the McDouble, but instead I would say no ketchup, no mustard, add Mac sauce. And it's like a mini Big Mac. Mac. Oh, the oh, secret Big sauce. Mac yeah. sauce. Add Mac sauce. Dude, I'm telling you, that's the way to do it. God damn. Yes, Encanto. Uh, Godbreaker. Coom song, Dance Had Me Dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you, dude. And couldn't queef the door. Lou is literally Paul Blart. Yeah. I actually just watched Paul Blart like two days ago. <laughs> Lou is ready to save Dave and Buster's at all costs. I mean, like, True. if I had no way to escape, which I always did have a chance to escape because I always worked like right next to the door most of the time. He's like a Shinobi. 
I would mostly just be like, come on, people, get out the store. You know what I mean? I'd be like the guy on the plane. Like, you know how you're supposed to, like, emergency exit? You're supposed to let everybody out? I'd be like, I got to get everybody out of here. <laughs> but as soon as I saw that fucker coming toward me, I'd be gone. gone. I'd be out. Fucking deleted. But let's say I'm working in, like, the, like, right next to where he started. Like, where he started yeah. popping off. Like, you got, you can't run by him. Fuck that, You got to sneak up solid snake style and take him out. <laughs> You know, I'm very confident. You thought I like about. It. It. I know Louis had yeah. to visualize. Yeah, you, you got to uh, assess the situation. Yeah, that's true. Gabino says he worked at uh, McDonald's when he was in high school in 2005. One afternoon, the real Ronald McDonald showed up and actually thanked him and the kitchen crew for making him look good. Peak pog moment. That is actually pretty fucking sick. Damn. Imagine it's just your manager Ronnie. dressed up as Ronald McDonald. Oh <laughs> shit! Just starstruck. But I think he's talking about like the Ronald McDonald from the commercials. Yeah. Like Chills. the actual. One. The actual one. No Chills. Way. Chills, brother. I get chills when that clown. Dude, when I think in. about Ronald coming into work, man, oh. oof, man, that's what gets me going. Gave us all a bag of just, just the happy toys. <laughs> have a great day. Just a bag of toys each. Didn't have to even eat the food. The shitty food. Dude, you it. know who's cooler than American Ronald McDonald? Japanese Ronald McDonald. What's so cool about Japanese Ronald McDonald? He does. He's just awesome. I've seen like a few commercials with him. Should I pull it up? Maybe. Yeah. There's some pretty cool ones. I don't think we've seen. Let me see real Japanese quick. Ronald McDonald pops off. Japanese Ronald McDonald. Yeah, I want to see it. Japanese Ronald McDonald. That's the one. Creepy oh. McDonald's commercial do that. <laughs> Ronald McDonald goes by the name of Donald McDonald in J McDonald's Japan. <laughs> Not to be confused with Ronald McDonald. Donald McDonald is Donald a different Donald. McDonald. Japanese Ronald McDonald commercials. Oh, okay. He's got a whole block here. Yeah, I'm telling you, he's lit. Let's check him out. No, hold on. What? Let me hear it. Yeah, it's amazing. I know. Tug of War. Salah. Is this a uh, fucking Squid Games? I loved it. I'm loving it. See that pitch, dude? Do you think American Ronald McDonald could throw a slider like that? He wouldn't be that serious when he did it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Good defense on Donald McDonald. I'm loving it. <laughs> so weird. Why does he sneeze? Yeah, why is the chicken sick? Yeah, I don't like that. He doesn't look as scary as our Ronald. Yeah. You gotta go to the scary, the creepy commercial that was right underneath this one. Do I, do I want to? Yeah, you do. That's cool ringtone, dude. Hey, of course. Moshimoshi, Donaldo this. Oh? And now, a serious message from Donald McDonald. <laughs> Thank you. I feel loved. I feel like I'm going insane with that. Yeah. Here we go. All right. Break it down. What's the stretch? Cake dog. Another message from Donald McDonald. How to dance. Okay. Rhythm. Okay. How to no, dance with do, Ronald. Do you agree this is a better Ronald McDonald, though? Uh, uh, better? 
I mean, we see. We I don't know. Listen, we, you gotta go bangers. to the video below. I don't. I don't approve of He's these reading books and commercials. Stuff. Go I, to I, the creepy one. I, this this Ron McDonald's reading books in the park. I our McDonald like makes magic and he and hangs one. out with the 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 the, the Hamburglar dude. Wait, is this real? You sure this isn't like a cursed video that I'm un, I'm not prepared for, Lou? We were not prepared. This is fake. Never mind. This is like fan made. This I've seen one that was really weird though, way back in the day. Not that, no. No, that one he grabs his dick. That's scary. Wait, Ronald McDonald's daughter. That one's good. What? Oh. I don't know, dude. This is Japanese Ronald McDonald right here. Uh, let me proof. Yeah, let me mm -hmm. proof it first. first. Oh, I don't know. Never mind. I saw McBeaver, dude. <laughs> She shows off saw, her McBeaver. She shows off the McGrand, dude. Yeah, I saw their uh, quarter pounder, if you know what I'm talking about. I have, you got to be careful until we watch Japanese commercials. They don't have nearly as many rules. That's yeah. true. But yeah, they uh, they got Ronald's daughter, and she's... Um, you can look it up on YouTube, She's chat. McLovin' it. She's, she's loving it. She's loving it, dude. She's loving it. All right, let's see what's, what Lou has to film now. Based on that small sample, I think American McDonald's, Ronald McDonald's better. It was a bad selection of commercials, I have to we, say. Dude, we... We've seen some really good banger ones, like the eight, like late eighties, early nineties, when it's like, "When it's a bad family," and Ronald's like in the snow, and he's yeah, like remember he's ice children. skating, and he's creating like magic and stuff. Yeah, That's but do way you cooler. really want a clown hugging your children with that After guy? After John sing? Wayne Gacy, you're trying to sell too hard. I'm just saying, clowns freak me out. I, uh, my kids playing sports with clowns, cool. My kids hugging a clown, mm. scary. Well, for like cheeseburgers. That. Do I get a free cheeseburger yeah. too? You might get an apple pie. Do I get a, a large fry? Maybe. I might get yes. an apple pie and an okay. ice cream. Okay, all right, all right. Free apple pie and an ice cream. Sorry, Jeremy. You're going to have to okay. hug that clown. All right, get that clown. Go hug that strange man. Okay, what am I feeling? Uh, okay, you guys, come on, come on. Uh, you're in a hurry. Uh, you're losing patience. You're looking for a manager. Uh, you need something. You're mad. Oh, you got a problem. Right, right, okay. I'm sexually frustrated. And who's gonna help me? Who's Question. gonna help me, huh? <laughs> you? <laughs> who's gonna help? And who's gonna help me? Come on. Oh, can, can I help, help you? <laughs> Good. Uh, my French fries are cold. Oh, oh, hey man, I'm sorry. I'll get you a new order. Man, uh, could I have some more? Back ketchup? off, Buzz. Oh, so many. So I'll many talk to your manager. Trick questions here. <laughs> oh, sure. How many would you like? Good. Uh, Ma'am. Yes, sir. Your oh. restroom is filthy. Ooh, I'm sorry. Yes. Um, thank you. It's McDonald's, sir. It's... There's diarrhea everywhere. <laughs> it's there's all... shit plastered <laughs> on the walls. It smells like piss. There's it's children's always. underwear covered in feces on the floor. It's always a mess. You know, it was fucking hilarious to me. We were at a coffee shop that had no bathroom. Uh oh. I was like, dude, you guys are serving up inducing, yeah, poop inducing foods. You have I... no bathroom. Like, good luck. Cafes have to have designated dumpers, right? I thought that was like necessary. Because, like, what are you going to do with all that spare motor oil? Yeah, yeah. it's a lot. Dude. And drain the street? No, that's illegal. It smells like fucking shit in this McDonald's bathroom, ma'am. Somebody pooped in the ball pit. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> oh God! <laughs> I shit my covered. Pit. My kid's covered in shit. <laughs> my shit. My shit covered kid went in your ball pit. <laughs> this guy uh, that shit in the urinal, Burger King. Oh wow. I, I don't. Uh, does the person who shits in the urinal, they're doing that vindictively, right? Not because there's like, oh, oh, where do I go? There's not enough time. It's really vulnerable to put yourself in that position. Yeah, huh? and then you're like hunched over. With your yeah. Asshole and, uh, what? Jeez. I remember this dude brought his kid into the bathroom to like etch into the toilet seat. Nice. Like, not only was he etching into, and I know it was the only person because it was like of near closing time. Nobody was coming in. He was the only person who went into the bathroom. I was like, dude, you brought your kid in there with you while you're like, hey, keep guard over keep guard. a fucking toilet seat. Like, check this out, dude. Look at this. It's like, dude, what the fuck is wrong with you? Well, now we learn how that is a learned behavior. But what if he? What if he was carving like John three sixteen? No, he was <laughs> carving like I don't even know, like some stupid gang tag or some shit. Oh, what if you know? What if it was a good message? You know? Yeah, spreading it the good word. I read it. It was just like, <laughs> you went in there and it read was it? like bloody loco or some shit. Like I don't fucking know. <laughs> Careful, your bro. restroom. Don't call him out. Your restroom is filthy. Ooh, I'm sorry. Yes. Um, thank you so much for telling me that. I'll make sure someone cleans it right away. Good. Uh, thank you again. Oh, sir? Yes? Can I buy you dessert? 
Hey. Well, I just really uh, Is that before or after you that. clean the shitty sure bathroom? <laughs> Are you going to wash your hands after the bathroom? Or? Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's an interesting proposition after you talk about how dirty your bathrooms are. It's like, uh, do you want some free food? Can I buy you dessert? Hey. Well, I just hey. really appreciate you telling me that. I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. Good. Good. That was nice. Good. That was really nice. Nice. And a good idea, Claudia. Thanks. That was neat. Okay, um, continuing on. Wait, with he made the bathroom needs. dirty? It was me. <laughs> he gave me that extra large fry. Mm. 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 Extra mac sauce, baby. Mm. Mm. Goes right through me. <laughs> mm. His mouth, dude. Mm. Who's going to help me now? Now what problem do I have? Mm. Mm. Got some extra Big Mac sauce on my upper lip. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm loving mm. it. Ma'am, my son wants to have a birthday party here. Do you have any information on that? Well, we sure do. That's wonderful. So, how old are you going to be? <laughs> Claudia, what? who are you talking to? Pete. The role play has <laughs> gone too far. He's gaslighting her. Uh, sorry. So, how old are you? He loves it. He loves it. The role play went too far. He's like, no, 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 no. It's good, it's good, it's good. Yeah, I'm a little boy. Yeah, keep going, keep going. I'm oh, I'm going to be a little boy. <laughs> a little boy. <laughs> Give me a kid's meal. I'm going to the playpen. Just talk to me. So, how old are you? 29 and a half. Uh-huh. Well, we are getting a little older, aren't we? Yes, we yes, are. Well. So, what's your name? My name's Louie. Well, Louie, every child ah, under four feet gets a little dude. prize when they come to McDonald's. You look like you make it like McDonald's. Yours. An invisible prize? Yes. Gee, thanks, lady. Hey. Hey. <laughs> okay, I know you're acting. That was neat, though. Uh, Danielle, do you give every child a premium? Play. Premium? Hmm. I don't know. Am I supposed to? Well, yes, we should be. Yes, absolutely. Premium. Every child should have a special experience every time they come into McDonald's. Mm -hmm. I mean, McDonald's and children just naturally go hand in hand. I was, but if we give I them was always treated like shit when I went to McDonald's as a kid. McDonald's. Yeah, they're like, don't use the, the trays as a slide. Yeah. They'd yell oh. at us. Remember that? Yeah, I got treated like shit. Just because we were destroying their play place. That was, yeah. that was so fun, man. Dude, you would go so fast. Yeah, chat, you grabbed the tray for food. You get that into the playpen. Sneak climb, it in. You, sneak you, it in. You climb, well, don't do this. Do, it, do this in the video game. You climb up with it, and then you're at the top of the slide, and you lay it down, you sit on the tray, and you fucking go. Yes, yeah, like the skeleton luge. <laughs> fucking luge in at McDonald's. Another thing I remember I got yelled at at McDonald's for it was like, where's your parents? They have to be with you for you to go to the play place. I'm like, they're just getting the food right there. They're like, nope. No. Nope. You got to wait. And take your shoes off. Make, you yeah, make sure you take off your shoes. It's like, you want me to put my bare feet where all these other people put their bare feet? That's disgusting. Yes. I didn't even like doing that as a kid. I feel like someone's going to steal my shoes. Yeah. Yeah, McDonald's shoe seat. But, dude, the McDonald's, like, shoe cubby thing. You remember that? It oh, had, like, yeah. those weird French fry people on it. Yeah, just the, the idea of being an adult and stealing children's shoes. Hey, someone's <laughs> done it. There's some weird guy with some weird fetish who's done that. I'm That's sure. so fucking weird, man. Oh, my. <laughs> Who the hell is stealing my shoes? <laughs> God damn. Yeah, that's pretty gross. It was an irrational fear, but now I'm thinking about it. Yeah, it's pretty fun. But if we it's give them a Oh, yeah. Someone's got a weird collection of... But if we give them a premium one time and don't give them a premium another time, then we've disappointed them. Yeah. And, and that's the worst thing we can do to a child, you know? Disappointing okay, children is the worst thing you can do? It's just about the worst thing that can happen at McDonald's. <laughs> it's a kid not having a good time. Cla not loving it. Claudia, the customer who asked you about birthday parties... What are you going to do? I would ask them to sit in the lobby while and I get Jennifer And rethink their choices Roy in Steve. life and not have their children have a birthday party at fucking McDonald's. Roy or Steve, because they're the birthday party experts. Right. Right. Now, if they weren't in, I'd get the shift manager and have him take the reservation right there. Right. Great. That's it. Good. Okay, Danielle. I would like to order a quarter Why? pounder with extra onions, mustard, and tomato. All right, sir. Let me put that order in right away. Quarter grill, coming back. Hey, sorry, we're closed. Hi, Mom. <laughs> Excuse Extra me. mustard. Sick Dan fuck. Mustard, you Danielle, onions? that's it exactly. Get the message back to the grill team pronto. All right, Lou, I got a good one. Check it out. All right. Okay, it's around lunchtime. And oh, now he's throwing down a scenario. Whoa, 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 whoa. Like this that. isn't Q&A. What's going on here? And in walks this grandpa guy with all these kids. You know, like grandpa. maybe 20, 30 kids, you know, all running around and stuff. And he walks Wait, this happened to says, you? Well, yeah. 20, 30 kids? 20 kids? Okay, maybe it was more like 
and her eight kids. Yeah. Okay. I'm this grandpa guy with the eight kids, okay? Uh, no, wait. Now, what do you kids want to eat? <laughs> Don't no, I'm not going to buy you happy meals. We're going to keep it simple. Hamburgers and milk. That's, that's it. Shut Chicken. up, or I'll throw you in playpen and never take you home. You'll stay there. You'll live in the playpen. <laughs> Chicken with you what? This, mister? No, keep, can we just keep it simple? Uh, may I make a suggestion? Uh, no, Claudia. He's got to work this out for himself. Yeah, it's the only way he's going to get through his nightmares. <laughs> Sorry. Now, now, Tommy, get off of that thing. Johnny, stop running around. Oh, I'm too old for this. this. Such a Don't good you people here. have waitresses? Well, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hey, Coach, are you in there, man? Yeah, I'm right here. I we lost say- him. We lost him. He's too deep in the. I don't know what I'm talking to anymore. <laughs> he became an old man. Maybe we could. Sorry, have the I got kids- lost in my method acting. <laughs> became Gorby. Kids sit down at a table and maybe have someone come out and take their order for them. Yeah. Is that what's right for the customer? Well, yeah, because he's got his hands full here. Yeah. Right. And. Oh, I got it. If it's what's right for the customer, I do whatever it takes to make them happy. That's whatever it cool. takes. Cool, I like yeah. this. Whatever yes. it takes. That's exactly what I was going to I say. Like nice I like this yeah. role-play stuff. Great. Do you know okay, where I could go next? to get more? Special information. Pete, where are the county fairgrounds? <laughs> okay, that's two blocks north to the Wait, first stoplight. You're, 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 you're a Google search at some point, too? You have, you have to be a tour guide as well. You're a fu- you have to Google know didn't exist. All Concierge service? Local attractions. <laughs> Can I take your reservations for the Disney World? Where's the fair at? Uh, you guys remember great. having to stop at a gas station to get directions? No. Not really. I remember every once in a while, like, my mom would get lost, and she would have to, like, stop at a gas station to either, like, look at a map. Like a Thomas a Guide. Do you guys remember that shit? Oh, oh my God. Maps. Great. Excuse Boomer. me. How do I get to Route 24? Oh, I don't know. Uh, Pete, maybe can well, you... where help? are you going? Good, good. Right. Back each other up. Folks. Yeah. That's great. Good. Um, this charity canister on the counter here, what's that about? Can Who I take this? Go to? <laughs> hey, I see a lot of money in there. Can I just have some? Can I crack that open like a, like a cashew and just eat that? It says something about helping kids. My kids are hungry. Can I, I just could take use some that? help. I'm a kid. Help me. Sir. Who are we helping? Well, sir, the money you donate to Ronald McDonald Children's Charities goes directly to help kids, mm-hmm. including support of Ronald McDonald House, mm-hmm. which is a home away from home for Randall hospitalized McDonald. children yeah, and their families. I remember MapQuest. Yeah. 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 Where is this? this out map. Yeah. Or MapQuest. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Right? Map. And there map are more quest. than 150 other Ronald McDonald Houses around the world. No kidding. Dude, nice over the years, I probably put yeah. h- at least yeah, $100 no worth of change inside the Ronald McDonald. The Ronald McDonald. Sometimes other people change. Like, they'll just leave it on the counter. I'll be like, all right. Boom, dunk. The alley oop. <laughs> like an alley oop, someone else's And trash. keep them coming back. Now, how do we do that? You get to know your customer. You let them oh, get to know up. you. And once you really start doing that, your job immediately becomes twice as much fun. Okay? Good. So fun. Closing crew's getting ready to go. It's still raining out there. I want to take a second to work on saying goodbye. Jeff. Oh, uh, goodbye. Uh, hey, man. Don't get too wet out there. Hey, man. All right, Danielle. Man. Take care now and take it easy out there. Good. Drive carefully and come back and see us real soon. All right. Wait, wait a minute. What's my motivation? Who am I saying goodbye to? <laughs> I'm a customer. And it's raining like crazy out there? Yeah. I feel like this is where someone goes, wait a minute, that guy doesn't work here. Wait, who are you again? That guy with the camera doesn't actually fucking work here, dude. I've never actually met you before. Uh, yeah. Well, I can't let you go out in that rain. Here, let me escort you to your car. What is What's that in Whoa. your hand? It's an umbrella. Oh, <laughs> all right, okay. all right. That's total customer satisfaction. Who's gonna say it's a knife? <laughs> Let me escort Wait, what you. What is he filming on that TV right now? Is it just boobs? Customer satisfaction. Nice job, Pete. Oh, no, it's, oh, it's cool. a feed. Satisfa- yeah, someone's boobs. Customer satisfaction. <laughs> yeah, that lady. Yeah, that's his thing. Every time he's got it down, he's kind of just oh, aiming down at Debbie. He's doing a peripheral vision creep mode. It's like, oh yeah, you gotta get going over there because yeah. it's just one of those things where you just. I gotta talk about greetings and stuff. Oh, sorry. A little Ugh. low on the camera. Oof. Customer satisfaction. Don't worry, we'll cut that out. Customer satisfaction. <laughs> nice job, Pete. Okay, <clears throat> closing crews, ready to go. We're all done here. Yeah. Thanks, everybody. Thank you all for really. participating. Were you even recording? This was really, really successful. I thought. You know what's fucked up to think nice about? Job. All those people weren't doing their jobs that whole time while the closing crew in the back just had to do everything. Oh, well, that was it. I thought something was. I thought like he was gonna be Ronald or something was gonna creepy, funny. Was oh, you thought they're gonna die at the end? It really felt like something was gonna happen. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I could have used that in the storyline instead. Something I else. I don't know. It's just kind of. <laughs> I get some more random shit here. I'll throw in some randos at the end here. Let's see. We have babysitting guide. Oh, this one that looks good. That one's bizarre. I like that haircut. 
University of Vermont. The facial flex. Shout out to Vermont in the house. Smooths the skin. It increases blood flow and gives Whoa. us a healthy glow. And Face now, flexing. you'll discover the exercise that makes your most obvious features look young and refreshed. Banana. Congratulations. You're about to discover the wonders of facial flex, the only exercise device that reshapes, retones, and increases circulation in your... Anybody using this? Anyone getting their face uh, worked on? The Jawser size thing? Face. It helps to do the same thing for this that you do for this. Have you seen like the bodybuilder one where they just like chew on this little thing? Yeah, it's like super gum. Yeah. It looks like a big mouth card. Mm. To give you those big jawline. <clears throat> so is she putting this in her ass? I she did gesture at her butthole. She was like, I know you like to play with this. Yes. It's time to start playing with this. Whoa. Now welcome to the new you with facial flex. Facial This one looks more intricate than the other ones. Oh, I mentioned you swallow that. Facial flex was developed Wait, is by this what they used oh. to make ladies dilated? science. Yes, the thing they shove up there so they can't get pregnant. It's the spatula. It's a speculum. It's the spatula, it's right? It's proven to work in test after test. Thanks for becoming a customer. Thank I you. I know you'll be as happy as we were when we first found Facial Flex. I want to see the guy like who developed it with like the biggest jaw. So I'm going to look like this guy? I want to see like big muscles on their face. Yeah, the Giga Chad guy. At that time, it was being used just by physicians for facial rehabilitation. But Bill saw immediately that it could be beneficial to all of us. He wanted to know if you could really achieve a facelift without surgery. Wow. So we submitted it for years of testing, submitted which proved <laughs> this was the exercise device that everyone had oh, missed until now. Oh, graph goes wow. up. Graph's going up. Graph's going up. That's good. Graph's going up. Can we get one of these? I want to try it out. You really want to try one? I do. You, you know can only have them used. You know that shoe would hurt. Oh, I don't want a used one. Oh. It worked. Independent I am a clinical doctor, studies as have you shown can see. that Dr. Ronald. facial flex Ronald using the Ronald. same dynamic Whoa. resistance, which strengthens Whoa. our muscles, increases <laughs> facial Whoa. muscle tone by 250 percent in just a couple of months, Whoa. and facial skin Whoa. becomes 32 percent firmer. Firm. You're going to get real firmer in your face. So all the skin on your face, chin, and neck is supported by a complex array of muscles. The stronger they are. The like, what's like the strong, like someone who could do like 10 pounds of this? What, what use is that? You could fucking pop open a popsicle without using your teeth? Yes, yeah, so you could bite something that would like snap like a, like a tree or something? Dude, you could like, like blow up a whole bag of balloons and your mouth won't hurt when you're done. You're like, dude, I could eat a burger without using my teeth. I can just use my lips. Oh, yeah, I'll gum it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it's easier to do it this way. I have a big, strong mouth. Yo, I can eat, like, beef jerky without using my yeah. fucking teeth. Just lip. Oh, 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 I can gluck, gluck it. The better you look. It was amazing. The Hellings had found something that really worked against the signs of the aging. Hellings. And it was just common sense. If you want your legs oh, moist nice. and healthier looking, right. they do nothing for the muscles Show underneath. Show the legs in the butt. They don't up muscles that we have in the body the body and the <laughs> body is a lot of muscles difficult, therefore, the face is hard to talk increase the, the strength and increase strength. the tone of it well, facial flex does that in addition Cut. around the mouth there are your mouth's like a rectum muscles that come in you can tighten the different it to areas. stop leakage and these uh, muscles really tighten it up to leakage and difficult to develop or difficult to increase the strength of or increase the tone of. I'm starting to so question this doctor's legitimacy. Looking at the anatomy of the facial muscles, we know that the facial flex <laughs> exercises them all. Ooh, your whole face. Strength. Your forehead, <laughs> your neck muscles, the back of your head, that hot dog in the back. It gets all of that. Yeah, the Chadwick in the back of your head. It's all of that. Because as I feel or palpate a patient's face while they are doing these exercises, my I can... Finger your mouth. I palpitate it. I put my fingers in and I go like this and I go like an accordion. I stretch out your mouth. I can oh, see how strong your mouth is. Feel the various muscles increasing in tone. In other words, getting more firm. Overall, <laughs> we found in our experience that facial flex... And excitingly so, produces so the results which are stated for it.
So here's to a younger looking you. After just two minutes. She's got those dimples. Twice Is that what you get? You I get want that dimples, fold? Dude. Each day with facial flex, you'll hear people say, Look, she's got too. You look great today. What have you done? I know it's something. Everyone's whispering. What we have found that also. That was your internal monologue? Back to what we have found. <laughs> Many of the patients have not told friends about using it. And that's I, a big secret. Uh, it's uh, where all the data comes from. Secret data from secret usage. To be fair, your the, friends would think you're a fucking freak if you're using this thing. Like, check oh, it out. Oh, 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 this oh, is an exciting oh, thing. Oh, my thing. Oh, oh, so exciting. Some of these people have told me, some of the patients have told me that they are stopped by individuals who... People get that uh, stopped. Whoa, whoa, sir, 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 I have to ask you. People get stopped. What are you doing with your face? <laughs> it's a secret. What are you doing? I mean, what are you so doing? strong. You, uh, it's a secret. You, uh, you know, you look so much younger in this kind of thing. We're younger. about to show you how to do it. You may want to get out your facial flex get it out. and practice along with Come us on. as we demonstrate. Get it out, chat. First, you get out your AirPods. Damn, it comes in a little, like, case. AirPods. <laughs> Rechargeable case. AirPods going in the mouth. You should know that facial flex is personal. Like your toothbrush, it's not meant to be shared. Start by rinsing your facial flex uh, in this thing stinks. warm water. Mm, water. Water. And oh, rubbing the cream. Check. They charge you for the cream. Check the elastic band to be sure James, it's properly it. placed. It's just a rubber With band. With all exercise, proper You can add more rubber bands for more oh, tension. Oh, that's this is next level. Weight restrictions. Wow, look how flex. young she looks. So exercise in front of a mirror. Watching yourself helps you maintain proper form while you exercise. You don't blow your Place mouth out. Place flex in your mouth. Imagine walking in on someone doing forward. this. Oh. And tilt your head oh my God. Back until your chin is level. She's really dilated. This extends the muscles of your neck. She looks like a hoop. A better workout. Wow. Relax your jaw so that your mouth is comfortably oh. open. Like a, blow <laughs> it's like a blow up doll. Oh. Ah. Should be about one inch apart. Compress oh. facial oh. wax by pushing oh. the corners of your mouth together. Oh. Hold the compression for a second or two, then release the facial <laughs> flex gradually. <laughs> Try not to move your jaw up and down <laughs> while duck. exercising. <laughs> When your facial muscles become tired, stop exercising. Oh, you may want to start out doing only about 30. It's hard just looking at it, huh? Ow. to 40 repetitions. As you become 40? stronger, 40? increase the rate and number Oof. of times you compress facial flex oh, I, until you oh, can do about so 120 weird. repetitions. Oh, breathe. Then maintain oh, this level each time you exercise. Hold on. It's like doing a chest doing live with your mouth. Repetitions should take about two or three minutes. When you're using proper form, your upper lip should oh, this flatten is over your teeth. Don't pucker when you compress facial flex. What that mouth do? Form an oval with your mouth. Oh. Fucking pop your dick off with her. <laughs> As you see here, this will smooth and flatten. Your <laughs> like a carrot. Oh. Just fucking carrot. Just snatch it like a celery stalk. <laughs> oh. You'll see and feel your facial muscles tighten. <laughs> now let's repeat the I mean, exercise. it's going to make your blowjob game Place go through the, the roof, though, right? In your mouth. It's so the amount weird. of uh, volume you could suck has just got to be astronomical. <laughs> blowjob. You, you saw the chart? It went up. Then lean. Blowjob charts going up. <laughs> slightly forward. Tilt your head back until your chin is level, <laughs> extending your neck muscles. <laughs> Relax your she looks so dead. Your mouth She's got like the dead fish eyes. Opens with your teeth about <laughs> an inch apart. Such a dead face. Push the corners Whoa. of your mouth together to compress the facial flex. Try Do we ever like flip it and go up and down and? Oh yeah. <laughs> Not to move your jaw up and down while you exercise. Nah, nah, nah. When you are first starting out, complete about thirty to forty. It's oddly mesmerizing. But stop I like looking at the mechanism that makes it work. Increase it's, it's the rate you know, it's modern in technology at its best. Yeah. When you compress facial flex, your upper lip should flatten over your teeth. Be sure to form an oval with your You're mouth. Doing tight oh, reps, tight up. reps. If your upper lip does ah, not flatten, wow. open your mouth wow. a little wider oh. while you compress the facial flex. I also feel like it's gonna make your mouth wider it's too. That shit must hurt so bad afterwards. Yeah, imagine the, oh. the doms the day after that. You know, like when you, oh, my face. you know when you chew gum too much and it just feels awful. To exactly. add more resistance and a hot more physiology and condition is different. You what may only the have fuck? Oh yeah, let me see Larry, oh, Larry David. David. <laughs> let me see Larry. Let me see other people. Firmer face, chin. Wow, she looks great. Look at that. 
Look at that big buff muscle over here. Yeah, her, her and tricep on her face. And neck. So whether you're 30, oh. 40, 50, hey, I'm or even 90. Hey, Larry David. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. Bum, bum. <laughs> bum, bum, this is like the end of the episode. Oh, 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 oh. Larry, <laughs> tell me the number, Larry. Oh, 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 tell me the number. Oh, oh, oh. Larry, tell me just the number. Just say the number. We can win the lottery, Larry, if you just tell me the number. Oh, 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 oh. With his hand. Oh, oh, oh. Fuck you, Larry. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Larry. Fuck you, Larry. Younger looking appearance. Exercising with facial flex. Now, just to be sure you understand there any more the whole of Larry facial David? flex program, let's How often should I do it? <laughs> the Q&A section. Replace them every week. In peace. Wow, wow you're going to be going through safe? this. Uh-oh. Well, you don't want them to snap and then you swallow it, right? Oh, imagine it, it, it snaps, it smacks the uh, vulva in the back of your tongue. Is what are you guys watching? Completely safe. Nothing? <laughs> don't uh, don't just tell mom. Just be sure to use it as we've shown you. And remember... It's meant for adult use. Only use it where we told you. Don't put this in kids' mouths. Or other oh, places. <laughs> oh, I didn't even go there. People love trying to tighten up things. Yeah. It's only for your mouth. So I, I think please, it would work in your anus. Please, keep it away from children. <laughs> a clean pinch every time. <laughs> Facial flex is a modern miracle based on ancient knowledge. <laughs> What the fuck? The Egyptians were doing this, dude. Now this is turning into an episode of like ancient aliens. Watch. It makes you look what? good what outside and feel good inside. What? That's like Just because you show theme. ancient stuff doesn't mean they did this. <laughs> Only Leonardo da Vinci must have done it. <laughs> because there's a painting. You know, aliens. When the aliens came to Earth, they uh, he gave us a lot of technology a lot of to uh, third, further advance mankind. Which is one of the small things. Uh, they actually found one of these in King Tut's tomb. Very excited about it. A lot That's why it's such a defined, godly jawline. Yeah, only a true face surgery. of a god. What happens with plastic surgery, unfortunately, is that unfortunately. the muscular will break down. Who's when guy? I saw it, I said, wow, I do aerobics every day, and here it is for my face. It did wonders for her <laughs> chin, her cheeks, and under her eyes. She gets compliments all the time. Wow. She gets Wait. the compliments all of the she time. She used it on her eyelids? Her <laughs> eyelids. <laughs> Her eye <laughs> Wait a minute. I said, wow, I do this delivery, this line. Aerobics every day, and here it is for my face. It did wonders for her chin, her cheeks, and under her eyes. She gets compliments all the time. Under her and eyes. And people don't know the secret. Under her eyes gets compliments But now all you the know the secret, and you have it in your hand. Facial flex. Your facelift without surgery. Oh, I feel like Tootin Common. <laughs> <laughs> Or even nine. It's like Larry. <laughs> Larry, you bald fuck! <laughs> what are you doing, Larry? <laughs> Say the number! Oh, Larry! You fuck <laughs> Say the number, Larry! Fuck you, Larry! Holy shit, fucking you Larry. Piece of shit! <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, Larry! I wanna watch this show now. <laughs> <laughs> Found this copyright free version of Curb is amazing. It's good music right here. Yeah. That should be the <laughs> thumbnail. I think he is going to be the thumbnail. Oh, yeah. What? Definitely. How about one more little weird one? Let's get weird. Let's get really weird. We have one on about abandoned mine safety. <laughs> That's very specific. Nokia cell phone local ad. I like oh, this. Cool. It's almost Halloween. <laughs> Whoa! Awesome. Oh, not much. Just hanging out. She didn't even answer it. Not much. <laughs> hanging out. Just picks up the phone. Not much. She's hanging out. <laughs> you fucked up the one thing. How to use the phone. Not much. Just hanging out. Oh, not much. Just hanging out. <laughs> the guy didn't even have a chance to say hello. <laughs> or what are you up to? What's going on? Shopping tomorrow for I'm there. Visit the JCC Haunted House, and when you buy a Nokia phone, get one free from Whoa. Planet Cellular. You're a authorized haunted house to the and a, a haunted house, and you get a phone plan. And real vampires.
ability. Get yours at the Planet Cellular booth at JC's Haunted House. JC's Haunted House. Yo, I want to go with this haunted cell phone. That's tight. That was a good one. These local ads. Whoa. Local Oakland. Shout to Oakland restaurant. Seafood. Mm. Mm. Seafood. Billy E. Jones, Zelda size. Eat more fish, be healthy. Aqua Fresh Seafood serves fresh fish every day. Come in, purchase a fresh fish, or take it home. Cook it yourself. Aqua Fresh serves it fresh. Mm. I just hope they don't break into song, because sometimes they do a song that's too good and then it gets claimed. Mm. <laughs> I mean, I kind of want food now. Nice. It's like a mukbang. It's pretty, uh, he's making it look good. Oh, oh goodness. Oh shit! Wait, the tail? Fly tail and all. Damn. Yo, that's a lot of fry. I don't know about that. You guys do that? Fuck no. I would never do that. You eat that crunchy shit? Get the fuck out of here. Chad, you guys eat the tail? Like the the fucking. It reminds me of like uh, cockroach wings. Yeah. Ugh. You know what I'm saying? And they're sharp too. A delicious fish dinner. Six pieces of fish, large fries, coleslaw, or potato salad, and bread. Bread. And a bread. Oh, dude, eating that would be Ooh. horrible. It's like plastic. Yeah. Shit will cut your throat probably on the way down. I think there's a way to like pinch the, the tail that you get all the meat out of it without having to eat the, the, the shell. Yeah, you can get all the meat out of there for right. sure. Yeah, I you used to do to. that all the time. Until I realized that was the fish's asshole. And then I was like, oh, I'll just leave that. That's in. the asshole. Oh, I can go without eating the asshole. Yeah. If you strengthen your lips with that thing, you probably just <laughs> pop it without yeah. having it. Mm. Try our delicious Ooh, prawn good. order. Six <laughs> piece jumbo prawns, mm. large fries, coleslaw, potato salad, and bread. Mm. So if you want your fish cooked fresh, mm. Fresh seafood. Dude, everybody's mm, and mm. so hard at that table. Mm. That's one thing the the mukbang people never really they didn't get in enough inventing more mms. Mm. Yeah, like you so much creativity with the mm. with the mms you could have done, but they don't do it. So good go, and oh, tasty. Oh, 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 oh. When we do our mukbangs, we really sell it. That's right. Yeah. What is this? We kind of did a mukbang um, uh, the day after Thanksgiving. Oh, yeah. That was right? good. Was that when we all picked a food? Chat's giving. Chat's giving. I went to uh, Hotties yesterday, and I was Ooh, telling them about geez. it. Yeah. And he's like, have you tried other chicken places? I was like, no. He's like, I went to that Dave's place. Not too good. Yeah. We I need like, to. you work here, bro. Like, how am I going to trust your opinion? We need to make that an annual thing. But this time, only literally one thing from each place, because that was a lot of food. Yeah, was so we good, got though. like a big sampler platter we from went each in, place. We, went in. we got like three plates from some. It was Chinese <laughs> food, Cuban of... food, <laughs> fried chicken, and something else. Oh, and dessert. That was awesome. Don't, everything's on sale. We even have a special room set aside for men's and ladies' clearance boots. You buy the first pair for fifty nine ninety eight. Whoa. Get the second for thirty nine dollars. That's two pair. Two pair for ninety nine dollars. Two, two pair. men's exotic boots like lizards, one hundred seventy five. Lizard just came out of nowhere. Lizard I boots. One hundred seventy. We got lizard boots. We even have a men's all leather roper made in America for fifty nine ninety eight. Boots just don't get any cheaper. Hey, he did. He kept, you know, almost fumbled. Hey, why going. not a second take, dude? Hey, he had it. Because why? Need your business, folks. We want your business. That's at Pee Wee Dalton's. We're just a half mile south. I have forty encores. Please come see us. Please. Oh fuck! Shit! I dropped my boot. Please come see us now. Come on now, please. I'm always looking for a good boot barn. Yeah. Come on down to the I really want some of those boots where it curls at the tip. You know uh, what I'm talking about? Like this. Yes. That's what I want. I oh. always keep one of these handies just in case Louie makes that same reference. I feel like he might have one of those in stock for you, Lou. Webster's definition of brunch. Sunday at Eddie Webster's restaurant in Bloomington. Oh. All you can eat for only eight ninety five. Look at that! All you can eat. Uh, so first of all, mm. broccoli and cauliflower brunch. Just raw. Just a raw. Listen, collie. if I'm doing all you can eat, I'm not getting filler shit like vegetables. Get the that fuck out of here. On an all you can eat platter, bro. Goddamn right. I don't know about all You're that. You're goddamn right, Louis. So delicious and so inexpensive. <laughs> Kids are only ten cents an inch. What? It's <laughs> Kids over They're there? They're measuring their children? <laughs> wow. Fun. Uh, Our fresh baked. It's like they turned the kid into Cinnabons.
<laughs> like they give you however big your kid is, we'll give you money back. They're only 10 cents an inch. 10 cents it's an inch. It's fun. They Our measure fresh your baked kid caramel they... rolls <laughs> are a fitting dessert for this delicious feast. Don't miss Eddie Webster's brand new all-you-can-eat Sunday brunch. Yo, is that Eddie on the fucking sax over there? God, I mean, dude, that music looks like good. shit, but his dope. sax is sexy. Sexy. Ass. I think they just don't know how to film food. You know what I mean? Yeah, it looks too so glossy. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else we got. Anything in here that looked good? <laughs> <laughs> foot job are, furniture? These are deep cuts, man. I see foot job furniture? Yeah. Foot job, foot job. Foot job furniture. Do, do y'all know that F&J Furniture's having a sale? Right now, buy three complete rooms of furniture for only $5.99. Three rooms? Three, three, three rooms worth of furniture for 600 bucks? That's insane. Three that is a pretty good deal. That's really good. And, and fifty dollars down will put you in a bedroom set or living room set today. Why buy it on credit? Your credit's always good oh, at FNJ Furniture, regardless if you've got bad credit, no credit, or on welfare or SSI. Nice. You've got credit at FNJ Furniture at low monthly terms. I would like to get a living room set. Damn, he's like, <laughs> how can I help you? No credit, no problem. I need a table. Yeah. What about three rooms worth of table. I can get you three rooms and tables. <laughs> he's, dude, he's just like right up in your face. <laughs> Do you have any credit? No. See the special man. Let her have it. That's I the special like man. It. Let her have it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got to check your credit. Uh, the credit man? Give it to you. All right, there you go. Just give it to you. Set of box Do you have credit? I just filed bankruptcy. Well, you need to see the special man. Let him have it. Yo, the special man's sick, dude. He just gives it all up? We need a special man. The lady was like, I have no money. I'm bankrupt. Give it to her. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. I like Thank special, you, special man. man. That's how a store should be. Tienes credito? No. Habla con el special man. No, I also don't understand the goddamn word you're saying. Uh, donde esta la special man? Man. Es, es, man no <laughs> especial, <laughs> hermano. Man no especial. Let her have it. You can take esto. I wanted him to say let her have it in Spanish I know. so bad. How would he say it? let her have it in Spanish? Have it you say? Frankie, right. let him have it. <laughs> Johnny's F&J Furniture, 315 North Broad, 822-8220. Go see Frankie and Johnny, the easiest credit men in town. Damn, they get the tastiest jams for some of these. Yeah, man. The fuck? When, it's, when special man's in town, you got to bring out the good music. Cowboy Curl. Yeah. yeah. It's his Red Dead RP character. Let's see what else we got. What Anything in here? A pharmacy ad? What the fuck? People talking about what pills they take? I don't know. What is this? <laughs> the Discord's getting weird. Med Plus Pharmacy. People you can trust. Your Med Plus Pharmacist is a valued member of the healthcare profession and a person you... Why is it awkward? Very awkward Med Plus Pharmacy. You can come to with questions about your prescription, over-the-counter drugs, or health and beauty aids. Med Plus pharmacies are <laughs> that guy's staring awkwardly. He saw a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> What's he taking? The locally owned. The person behind the counter is a friend and neighbor. It's a matter of trust. Budo. at Med Plus. Lick his ah. lips. I love how he licked his lips. Oh, well, look at this father-son combo. Okay, here. Matter of trust. Yeah. At Med Plus, I don't trust that guy around my children. Art, how art and art, art, Artie and Artie. Double art. Expert healthcare. Hometown convenience and everyday low prices. <laughs> Med Plus Pharmacy. <laughs> <laughs> the look down. Look at this guy. Everyday low prices. Med Plus Pharmacy. <laughs> Whoa. People you can trust. And they like really produced a nice ad for them. Yeah, they just were weird. They're just no one there is hip to being on camera. <laughs> that guy's my favorite. <laughs> He looks like he, you know, the scene in Ghostbusters when they yeah. go to the library? Yes. He looks like he got scared by that <laughs> library ghost. Yeah, he's the German yeah. guy or whatever the fuck. It's like he's <laughs> hiding something in his butt. <laughs> That's what the vibe I get. What a look. Plus pharmacies are locally owned. Hey, I'm getting a vibe off you, man. Get you got anything vibe. in your ass? Get a vibe. Pat this guy down. A bunch <laughs> of pills. His ass. A bunch of pills come out of him. Person hey, how did you know? Yeah, you shake that guy like a pinata. A bunch of <laughs> pills are going to come out of hey, this guy. This guy's guy. paying off. He wants to matter all. Yeah. <laughs> 
This guy's, yeah, pocketing and selling. Pharmacies are locally. Yeah, he's like, I didn't actually, I'm not actually a pharmacist. I just put on a lab coat, walked in. And, no, the person no. behind the counter is a friend and neighbor. It's a matter of trust. <sighs> At Med Plus, you get expert They healthcare. so don't know what to do. Hometown convenience. I don't even think they know each other. And like, they're named after each other. Uh, the, the, the production's so good, too. I would have been like, should we get them, like, working? Yeah, doing like look at the stuff. look at the camera and then start shelving. Nah, nah, nah. Just fucking stand. You know there. that classic thing you see in like even like a CVS commercial where they're like they're handing the stuff to the customer. And they're yeah. like, yes, yes. Every day, low prices. No, Mid he's just shamed. Plus shamed. <laughs> Pharmacies. <laughs> Deep pharmaceutical <laughs> shame. <laughs> totally shame. <laughs> Pharmaceutically induced shame. 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 That's awesome. Anything else from the Discord that looks good? Ooh, Pistol Pete's Pizza. Ooh. Oh, this looks like a pog place to go. Dude, can we have a fucking gathering at Pistol Pete's Pizza Emporium? Mm-hmm. Buy a large pizza and get our boot to boot. Yo, let's go! You get a boot? Boot chug. Dude. That's right. Bad These kids chugs. know that during the month of October, Dude, Pistol kids Pete's eyes? Pizza. They're trying to chug. You can get the I bet Badlands went here when he was a kid. That's Where how I got inspired. Where it started. Uh, during October, you get a uh, boot mug for free. A Pistol large. Pizza Damn. Boot mug free with the purchase of any large pizza. <laughs> Drinks just taste better when you're drinking from the official Pistol Pete's boot. When you're doing a shoey. <laughs> mug. And during October, it just it's tastes free better. with the purchase of any large pizza. <laughs> Which one's better? Yo! Oh, dude, double fist. Dude, he's about to go in. Dude, that's Future a legend. A two-dollar value, yours free. So oh, buy young a large pizza and get our boot to boot only at Pistol Pete's Pizza with five locations Las Vegas right here and in Henderson. Las Vegas and Henderson. Yo, Ooh. is Pistol Pete still around? That's not too far away. Pistol Pete's Pizza. Pistol Pete's Pizza. Get our boot to pizza. Boot. That's right. They like this kid. He like owns it now. I hope. I hope so. I hope this kid owns it, because let's face it, Pistol Pete was running on a diet of uh, Mountain Dew, Dr. Pepper, and pizza. I don't know if the man, any man's heart could keep I, going. I, I don't think Pistol Pete is, no! is around anymore. No, I wanted it. Damn. I'm, I'm going to the deepest part of the internet, boys. It's not looking good for old rest of Pistol Pete. Damn it. Yours free. Ooh. Damn, dude. Damn. I lost a legend. Pistol Pete, yeah, anybody in chat ever have it? Man's a legend. Anybody ever had it? Pistol Pete's Las Vegas. You guys want to do some Goro? Oh. All right. You guys want to do some Goro? We can do a little Goro right now. Oh. Let's do some Goro. Here we go. Place your bets. And here we go. Oh, magic genie in the lamp. Give me an idea for the biggest water bet sale in New Orleans history. Oh, genie. Please, genie, give At me another genie. idea. A good idea to sell more water Give me bets. a bet that I can't lose. What's that? Give me a Goro. Answer to your list. This month on water bet showcase, we're going eight. But I'm no eight. I'm crazy, Marty. That's not Goro. This month on water bet showcase, you buy one bet, you get one free. That's right. At our veterinary, our New Orleans, and our Slido location. Buy one, get one free. Ha, ha. Oh, please don't give me Poorilla, Genie. Please, Genie. Give Anything me. but Poorilla. Another idea. Come on, Poorilla idea needs his big payoff. Let me get a big bet. Let me get that big bet. Fuck. This motherfucker, you bet on the wrong mutant primate for the last time. It's me, Ron Jeremy. You stupid motherfucker. Fresh out of jail, motherfucker. You guys, there's your, there's your Goro. You guys wanted it. There it is. Made an appearance. Dude, yeah. costumes have gotten so much better. Yeah. Like, look at the... Oh, it's him again. He looks great. I like this guy's style. Yeah. Not feeling it, Lou? I, there's something about him I don't like. I trust him. Looks very similar to somebody I see, like, every day, but I don't know who. Crazy Marty from Waterbed Showcase. Instead of being crazy, let's get serious for a moment and show you why we have a better product. The surfaces of our mattress are 22 Oh my god, mil that looks look at that. horrible to sleep in. It looks like uh, like if you had a nightmare, your bed was eating you. It would feel this like this. This is what I imagine people who do like those videos where people do salvia. Yeah. And they think the couch is eating them. This is our I mattress. think they feel like are this. Yeah. I remember one time I spent the <gasps> night at a friend's house. And they made me sleep in like the grandma's room because she wasn't there. And she had a water bed. It was so hard to go to sleep. Ugh. Sounds awful. It felt like sleeping in the ocean. You're just like this. Ugh. Every little movement you make, because I don't, 
Sometimes I sleep on my stomach. Sometimes Shuffle I sleep around. on my side. Yeah. Dude, every time you move, it's just like sloshy, oh, sloshy, oh, sloshy. Sloshing, dude. Look and you're just that. afraid you're gonna pop it, you know? What that fucking what? shit? Why did this ever Hands take off? Fifty-four mil thick. Because they pop. No, but I'm Before saying, like, why did this why did this mil- fad take? The 70s, bro. The surfaces a lot of people are, were high. are 22 mil thick. I guess if you're Our high in coke, this seems like a great mil idea. Thick. 64 mil thick. Inside our mattress, we have hydraulic baffles. There's no fiber, there's no foam, and they don't dislodge. dislodge. Now, if you don't buy a bed from Waterbed Showcase, who's crazy? You or me? Ha, 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 ha. Oh, you, sir, are a crazy. <laughs> it's a me, a Wario. <laughs> I get Mario, like, Wario vibes from this guy. Yeah, if Wario sold water beds. Runner up for the, the Wario. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Who's a crazy now? <laughs> yes. Ugh. Scary. <laughs> Sharp sting. Scary. What the, what the fuck? fuck is this? I don't know, man. These are from the Discord. They're weird. Yo, people are weird in the Discord. Dr. Scamuzzo, I belong in a group that gives parties. Can you make the next one a success? Why certainly, my man. Your problem is my solution. I give parties all the time for crawfish, shrimps, and crabs. Are they good? Oh, there's good medicine. Try for yourself. Thank you, doctor. Seafood City is a very they don't cook the order. They just cook it in a big mountain like that. We cook a big batch of boiled crawfish. It's like a landfill of corpses. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> that looks like they're processing trash. Seafood City, 1826. Oh yeah, I think we've actually seen them before. Yeah, yeah we've, we've seen one of their commercials. Yeah, we've before. seen one of those. Jesus. What well, crawfish? Three pounds. Doctors prescribing that. Ooh, we got oh. something for all the fashion friendly fellas. What is this? Men's oh, clothing. Men's drip. Men's nice. drip. Men's drip. We could use some fashion updates. Palm Just Beach. New York. Shout out to Palm Beach. Palm no, Beach Mall. <laughs> you better believe it. I like you there. Rock aware. Echo. You better Rock believe aware. it. Rock aware. Echo. Rock aware. Echo. Echo. You better believe it. Academics. You better, you better, you better believe it. <laughs> better, better, you better, you better, you better. Okay. Echo. It's day one. Fun. Keeping it real. Baby Jean. You better believe wow. it. Get your shop on. It don't wow. <laughs> what? I've never seen that before. I don't even know what right, that they is. They got Palm Beach on lock. New York man's got everything. Sean, Sean John. John, dude. Nice. Like the Tims. Yes. Those are nice. Sick. Oh, man's got Got everything in stock. You heard me? Like the baggiest <laughs> shirts. Like that is a small. Yeah. The the fucking arms of the the short sleeve go down to like your stomach. Yeah. There's the style. You better believe it. You better believe it. I always thought there's this like one kid who's like really short and he wore clothes like that. I always just thought he's wearing like his dad's shirt. The school. <laughs> You better, you better, you better believe it. You better, you better, you better, you better believe it, believe it, believe it, believe it. A furniture company. Oh my god. What's this guy got going on? Oh my god. Hey everybody, furniture co. So he's bald, but he's got the wizard hair going. See survival reorganization sale. We've got a ton of furniture that must go without fail. Living rooms and dining rooms and bedrooms such as these. Goodness, what a sacrifice. Come take advantage, please. Please, 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 please. We're down on bended knees. Come down to both locations. Take advantage of him on his knees. Take advantage of me. (laughs) Take advantage of my sacrifice I give to you. Take advantage of me (laughs) on my knees. Please, please, please. Please, please, please. You're going to save a bundle, so take advantage, please. Y'all come down now, you hear? Take advantage. He's on his knees. He's uh, he's in desperate need of some um, taking advantage of. On his knees, Larry. Oh, 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 he's got the bankruptcy <laughs> court case at the bottom of the fucking commercial. Do you see that? <laughs> yeah, he's uh, he's bankrupt. He's on his knees. <laughs> Larry is always choking at the end yeah. of an episode. Uh, just say it, Larry. Just say it out loud. God damn it! This oh. song's cracking up. We gotta go off on this one. Thank you guys, as always, for watching. We gotta we gotta do some other stuff. Appreciate you guys. Best community on Twitch. Everybody with titties, bitties, subs, resubs. The best community on Twitch. Mm-hmm.
Popo, we in got the, the Lou. 90 months. Wow, dude. It's been you. a minute, dude. All right, chat. We will be back tomorrow. We will. We'll be back tomorrow. Yeah. I wouldn't mind playing some Cult of the Lion, not going to lie. Yeah. Well, looks cool. We're really cool, actually. I wouldn't mind doing that. But yeah. Love you guys. We will see ya. And yeah, we're going to watch a little Batman Forever. That's what we got to get into. ba da ba -da. What Thank you, you, what? What were you thinking, Larry? What were you thinking? Why would you put that in your mouth, Larry? Larry, oh. you son of a bitch! Why would you put that in your mouth, Larry? Why? Oh. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Why would you do that, Larry? Why? Why would you do that? Let's hit Tiger Rider back. Oh, he raided us on Jabubo. That was a big pop. Yeah, he's playing that game. This game looks really good too. Maybe we'll, yeah, maybe we should play it tomorrow. I want to play it. Chad and Grace looks cool. Have a good one, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace. Glow, uh, Glowboy Jose on the way out. Thank you, dude. Appreciate Thank you very you. much. Thank you, everybody. Peace. <laughs>